Hi, how's it going everybody? It's Friday night and you know what that means. That's right, it's back for more Camarocho real estate business. Uh, last time we were doing this... Jesus Dragon! You can't start a stream off by... Oh god! I, I can't really complain about that, I actually spent over $100 in N64 games. Don't judge me, I'm a collector. It's a very expensive hobby. Uh, t last time we were doing Yakuza, we were working our way towards the second billionaire, which is the Electronics King. Yes. So far, we've got a majority of his share, but we still got a ways to go before we can take him out. But my goal tonight is to hopefully knock him and the Pleasure King out. That way we can save the Gambling King and the Final King, which is the... Was it the Disco King? Oh, congrats, Dragon. Uh, yeah, we're gonna save the... Hopefully, start to work on the last two kings as well. So, for now, let's take a look and see what we got. I know there's a couple places... Okay, we already invested in that stuff. Alright, staff-wise, this is actually a really good day for these two, so... Alright, uh, pay out. Pay out. There we go. No, what? Am I, am I not gonna be able to pay out? Oh, that's because it's already underway. I think I did the payout stuff before we ended it off last time, so we gotta go kill our, kill some time around Camarocho. How addicting Plants vs. Zombies is? Yeah, it is. It's incredibly addicting. I think, I think on the 360 version of the game, I actually managed to 100% that, which I never thought I'd be able to say, but damn it, Plants vs. Zombies is just a really addicting game. I might actually, I was thinking about doing that as like a laid back series as well sometime in the future. Just when, it, when it's been a tough day at work and I just want to decompress and just relax. I want to play some Plants vs. Zombies. It's a very hands-off game. Alright, so let's see. We still got to go there for that stuff, which I'm still going to avoid like the plague. 360 version is the best, mainly for the versus mode. I never actually played the versus mode. Mostly because I never had anyone to play versus with. But who knows? Maybe we can do versus sometime. Uh, let's see. What all is there left for us to do here? Uh, let's see. Substories. Alright, so we're missing how many? We're halfway done with Kiryu substories. Holy hell. Also, halfway done with Majima's. It's weird that Majima has 20 less substories than Kiryu. Uh, we got a lot of stuff to do, so might as well. Head on over to the electronics area and see if there's anything that we can do over there. There was still a location over here, and I swear the Sega High Tech Land is one of the locations that we need to invest in. Because when we go to business, go to electronics, the uh, HL Sega Naki Namakichi Street is one of them. And is that Namakichi? Yeah, so it has to be this, but I can't figure out how I'm supposed to get the Sega unless I was actually supposed to beat the Electronics King at the, the racing game. Because this is the only location that we are still missing out on. It's weird that I can only talk to her. Well, I mean him, but that's only to replace stuff inside the crane games. And the only uh, the only one here is the, the racing game. It's not Space Harrier. Hmm. What if I were to actually play the game on my own? So I'm have a bit of an advantage since the plants build up is slow going and sadly versus his local play. Ah. I'm surprised I never made that an online thing. Alright, what were the controls? It's always weird that B is accelerate and A is break. I figured you'd swap the two around and I can't change controls for this. And we're off. I think I messed up that start. Uh, it's such a weird, like, way to hold a controller. I actually have to, like, 
lay the controller flat and also uh, like have my fingers above the buttons. Just keep going fast when you get those straightaways. Uh, ooh, oh no, oh no, oh no, we, we saved it. Faster. We'll go right this time. Oh, so close. Ah, oh, we ran out of time. Damn it. Ah, damn. Alright, we'll do it one more time. Splash wave. Uh, oh, right. Uh, I hate the fact that B is accelerate. I knew it was going to throw me off at least once. soon. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, we failed it this time, big time. And we're at the home stretch too. Damn, I am not good at this game. All right, we'll give it one more try. I at least want to get to the next area. Too slow on the start. Uh oh. Okay, I don't know how I managed to get around that guy, but that's cool. There we go. Throw the needle. Too fast, too fast. Oh, oh, God. Can we make it? Can we make it? Checkpoint! Ah! Oh, barely. Ah, oh boy. Oh no. Oh dear.
Ooh, her turn. Man, this is trippy to look at. And we did make it. Yep. Ah, oh, well, we made it to stage two at least. Slow progress. Oh, we were actually almost at the turn. Wait, there was an intersection? I didn't notice it unless I was literally coming right up on it. Alright, let's get out of here. Other drivers, hey, who's this asshole speeding at 65 miles per hour in a 30 mile, power, uh, mile per hour road? You say 60 when we were going 250. Ah, I knew it! That was some really good driving there. You think so? Thanks. Your steering was amazing. I couldn't tear my eyes away. I picked up a few tips for my next run. Tips? So, you play this game too? Yes, I always love racing games. No kidding. If you've been if you've been playing them for or a while, I guess you're pretty good, huh? <laughs> I'm pretty fast if I do say so myself. <laughs> you sound confident. I'm no slouch. I could give you a run for your money. I know. Next time I get a new high score, I'll tell you about it, okay? Sure, let's see what you're made of. Many road laws were broken that day. <laughs> All right, my name is Luca, by the way. What's yours? It's Kiryu. Kiryu-san? Got it. Okay, Kiryu-san. I guess I'll see you around. Oh, God, we gotta do a lot of racing. So much racing! And I'm guessing my friendship with her doesn't go up until I beat her high score every time we come in. Well, at least I know how I'm supposed to get the, the Sega Arcade now. But for now, let's head back to base because I'm sure that the collection is finally done. I'm just happy I was able to snag some shirts and got one of Kai and Basil, my boys. Well, congrats. You finally got that much-needed Amori merch, Dragon. Oh, do you have something to say? Kiryu-san, is there something? I oh, right, it's be to change the interior. Never mind. All right, let's get some collections. Oh, we still got a ways to go. All right. Actually, I need to take a quick intermission real quick. Uh, so while we wait for the money to be collected, I got to step away for a moment. So I'll be right back.
Okay, and I'm back. Sorry about that abrupt break. Uh, just had to go take care of something. But we should be good for a bit now. Hopefully, now, we should be able to get the payout from these places. Yep, all the payouts ready. Wow, that was a good payout there. And there, too. Holy hell. Jeez, I barely scratched the Pleasure Cane area, but we're already up to 19 million. Nugget, how could you? Alright, economy's up and safety is good, so... Let's start collecting over... Nope. There we go. Ah, shit. I forgot to invest. Invest! Let's see, food. Uh, I really do not want to pay that 28 million, so we'll go with Tomi. Or Tomoni. Or to Tuomi. There we go. Oh, I already invested. Wait, what? No, there we go. If it's 2 million, I don't mind it, but when it comes to 28 million, then I have a problem until I get a very decent amount of money in my pocket. Wait, who is it? Oh yeah, Koshimitsu. It says no employee should feel the streets. Yeah, I, I you know what? I've been thinking about this for a while, but after our interview with him, it's super weird that he's security and not, say, like, an advisor. Because the whole thing with uh, his, like, side story was that we hired him because he was good with figuring out what good places uh, to eat were. So you would think that he would be an advisor when it came to food and stuff. But unfortunately, no. Uh, that one has a way to go. Ugh, God, no. Kill, please. Thank you. I mean, it's good we have Mama with us, but still. I always just found it weird. We still need a double circle for love and double circle for shopping. Alright, that's already fully invested. Alright, that's all good. And finally, we still need the sushi place. Thankfully, Mamba just put us over the edge there, so I think now we have everything at an S rank in the Leisure Cane area. Yes, we do. I do need to swap him out, though, because we are basically done. Uh, sure. You're not great, but you're not horrible either. Who else is not on duty? You two. The, the bare minimum. I'm going to get not a whole lot back, but at least I'm not going to be losing money. Now that that is done, let's head back out. I swear, if you hear libido for double circle love. Oh, God. Oh, God. Could you imagine? If I hire libido. Mm, I think... Didn't we pick up a card earlier? I think he might actually be down by the shogi parlor. I might as well stop over there real quick and see. I could knowing this game. True, Yakuza is a series that you are surprised at every turn, but at the same time, you aren't surprised either that they would go with that option. I might as well go see if he's actually down here. Oop, sorry. Uh, no, this is the end. 
I don't see him skulking around down here, so we might be safe from the libido for now. If you see a woman running, then you're in the right area. Hey, just be happy that he's wearing pants in this area, dragon. It's still 10,000. I cannot find a million yen machine anywhere to save my life. Not great. Come here. Come here. Come on, we're going for a ride. Oh, wait. Almost. Ah, damn it. I saw it for a split second. Come here. Come here. Ah, almost. Ah, get off me. Ooh! Ow! Yeah, you're gonna lose a few teeth from that one. Also, might need a completely different hand. Get out of here. Oh, he's got a taser. Well, he had a taser. Now I've got a taser. Alright, I'm just going to take this moped and drop it on your face. Yeah, they always say that, but they always do it. I still got 13 completion points. You know what? I think when it comes to getting my next uh, completion point thing, I'm going to invest it into the business. Because I just really want to get this money out faster. Find it eateries. We're almost done with that. Complete. Uh, order everything at the menu there. Complete. Okay, so order food at all the places. Let's see. Menu in... That one's actually pretty easy. There's only four things on it. Smell burger, also pretty easy. Earth Angel is actually almost done too. Where the hell is Earth Angel? Earth Angel is. Oh, it's all the way over there. It's the bar that we were doing that one side story with. Alright. Well, while we wait to go over there, I might as well stop back into the arcade and see what the high score is. Nope, nope, guess not. I guess we just play until we get our friendship up to max. Now that I know what I need to do for this, we should be good. Oh dear. Oh no. Alright. So yeah, it seems the trick to this game is go to low gear when we're doing terms and high gear when we are going through straightaways. Oh no, oh no, spin out. Oh, we saved it. Oh no! Oh, yeah, that's a that's a crash. 
Uh, we might be able to pull it off. We'll see. Here's the final straightaway. Nope, we're not going to make it. That crash k killed this run. Damn it. And we were so close, too. You're going about 160 since the game measures it in kil uh, kilometers. Here's the hard turn. Oh, boy. And now the straightaway. We'll go left this time. Ah, oh, come on. Where's that checkpoint? Ah, there it is. Hope no one heard that. I s oh, don't patronize me. Heh, <laughs> thanks. I'm really close to getting a new personal best score, so wish me luck. Sure, let me know how it goes. Holy squeaky chair. That wasn't the chair, that was actually the, the mic stand that I'm using. Yeah, my chair actually doesn't squeak at all, which is good. Oh, Kiryu-san. What's up? I finally got a new high score that should be a challenge to beat. Nice work. What score did you get? Get this. I got a total of... 1,500,000 points. Jeez. Wow, that's a pretty good score. You weren't lying about being good at these games. Hey, you don't believe me? Heh, <laughs> sorry. Hmm. Anyways, while you're here, how about a challenge? Challenge? If you beat my high score the next time you play, I'll give you a present. Hmm. That sounds interesting. Great. Are you ready for the challenge? Do I want to try this now? Let's go for it. I want to check the bit rate. Uh, yeah, we dropped a couple frames, but we should be good. Thankfully, it's not going to affect uh, the VOD because I actually am uh, doing something new where I record the streams that I do at the same time as streaming, so it should uh, still be normal when the VOD goes up. I knew you couldn't resist. Okay, let's see if you can beat my score then. The scores you get when competing against Luca don't count towards the completion list of rankings. Okay. Also, if that was a mic stand, then oil it. Don't worry, it's still a new one. It's just got a, a, some kinks that need to get worked out of it. But it, it's still fine. It's not like completely rusted through or anything like that. Alright, 
Wait for it. Go! Okay, so maybe the best way to do this is to stay in the high gear until we see signs come up and then swap to low gear. Just like that. Or maybe not. Maybe it's only if I'm really close to wiping out. Like this. Oh boy! I didn't even see that was a squiggly one. Hi, Moon. Come on, almost got her. Alright, there we go. We beat her score. Excuse me, sir! <laughs> Why are we yelling? Because it's fun! Wow, that was a me that was an amazing score. I do okay when I go all out. I can't believe you just blew past my score I worked so hard for. Well, I came out on top this time, but if you keep at it, I think we you can do even better. You really think so? Alright. I'll brush up on my racing skills and try to get the score you can't match. Yeah, let's go another round. You're on. Oh, here's the present I promised you. Take it. The alertness hood. What? What is this Assassin's Creed cow that I just got? You know what it takes for me to wear those shoes, Dragon. This hood helps you break uh, break down alcohol in your body, allowing you to sober up quickly. Defense 2, Blade 1, Firearm 0. Mm, gives me slightly better defense. Firearms aren't really that common right now, so sure. Don't tempt me. I'm just saying, you know what it takes for me to wear those shoes. And that's just to preserve my sanity. Let's see. Pops, check out my new bat slip. I hate you, dragon. All right, vampires rule. No sanity, of course. All right, since you summon Alucard, it means I have to wear it for half an hour now. Great. I'll do it right after we get done with this race. You're an absolute madman, Dragon, you know that? Alright. 
That one turn is the one that'll screw me over, so I need to be careful when I see it. I think it's right after this one. Yep, nope, still left turn. There it is! Phew, saved it. Oh boy, oh boy. Do not scratch your face when you're driving, dude! Hands at 10 and 2! Oh god! Woo! Woo! Uh oh! Oh god! You know, I actually had a better time going right, uh, last time. Oh, boy. Too far, too far! Oh, yeah, this is definitely trippy to look at. I wonder if there's actually a gif of something like this just to mess with people. Because they would have completely throw them off and just, like, get them all weirded out. Oh, God! Oh, no, Sprock! So I came back to something about kinks. What did I miss? I, I don't even remember where kinks came up in discussion. <clears throat> Oops, nope. I was talking about his mic stand and how it's new. Oh yeah, getting the kinks out of the the squeakiness of my mic stand. Not not those kind of kinks, Moon. Nope, we're so close. Nice driving again, Kiryu San. Yeah, thanks. I'm really close to getting a new personal best score, so wish me luck. Sure, let me know how it goes. Alright, give me a second. Let me get 30 minutes on the clock. Uh, I didn't say anything. Dra Dragon, since we're not really... You know what? You know what? Nope, I'm actually going to keep my mouth shut. You asked for this dragon, so you get it. Uh, no, they're back. No! Oh, Kiryu-san. What's up? Great news. I got a new high score on the game. Yeah? How many points? I don't know how I pulled it off, but I got three million points. Three million? Only? That's amazing. I, I still could do better, though. I was disappointed you won last time, so ever since then I've been practicing hard every day. All 10 seconds that I left. Yeah, top players tend to uh, be the types who really don't like to lose. So what do you say, Kiryu-san? Think you can take me on? I'm pretty confident I got you beat this time. If you can top my score, I'll do something really special for you. I don't like where this is going. Something special. Let me see. Okay, if I lose, I'll give you the... No, oh, why is the saxophone here? <laughs> what is this cheesy porn music playing right now? The ride of my life. Does she mean Dame Dane? Dame yo Dame. Uh what do you mean by that? I'm not telling. But trust me, it'll be worth it. I need an adult. Kiryu-san, I am an adult. Between you and me, 
I've been dying to just do it myself, so I'm so into it, I bet you'd be amazed by it. <laughs> I would. She's offering me a ride? <laughs> Why did you have to zoom in on Kiryu's crotch? Can I be good at it? Uh, <laughs> what? I thought we were just gonna play some racing games. What did this devolve into? Is something wrong, Kiryu-san? <laughs> uh, no, nothing. I'm okay. Relax. Oh, okay. So, what do you say? Want to try and beat my high score, three million? This might be tough, but. It'll be worth it. Jeez, Kiryu's going for it. Holy hell. Okay, I'll give it a shot. I knew you couldn't resist. Okay, let's see if you can beat my score, then. <laughs> Kiryu may be good at outrun, but he can't outrun these ladies. What's going on with the new Sly video? Hang on a second. I need to check something real quick before we get started. Pause this. All right, it's not there. Hmm. All right, never mind then. I'll have to check that later. Okay, let's go. We'll go with the passing breeze. Sorry if there's not going to be a whole lot of talking, I am actually going to try and focus to beat the high score. We did it last time, but that I'm probably going to botch it this time around. But now that I know the tricks to these turns, we should be good. I think I might actually go to the right this time, just because I seemed like I made it further that way than I did when I went left. Also because going left also is really trippy. And I think we might have just failed this. Oh yeah, we definitely failed this. There is no way in hell we are not going to win this. Yeah, seven seconds and we're already at the turn. No way. And of course, I can't even immediately retry it. I have to go back and talk to her again. <sighs> Looks like I fell short. That's too bad, Kiryu-san. <laughs> no, not the cats! You're welcome to try again if you want. Remember, you gotta win if you still want to ride with me. Yeah, definitely. I'll do better next time. Kiryu, please! Ouch. Wait, nope. I don't think I had the tattoo. I didn't want to go to Outrun itself. Damn it. Unskippable. Ugh. 
Uh, let's see if I can escape this. There we go. Ugh. There. Much better. Squeak chair. No, I was just adjusting the, the lumbar pillow on my chair. Alright, let's do this. Get ready. Don't bounce me around! Oh, wait, here it is. Oh, too far. Too far. Oh, come on. We're so close. There we go. Beat it. But we'll see how far we can go before we completely just spin out and lose. Ah, uh, we were right outside there. We were about ready to get to the turn. Or not, not the turn. We were already locked into a position. Alright, well, whatever. We beat the high score. Let's get this over with. I'm dreading for what is coming. I, I gotta get contemplating Kiryu up and ready to go in a second. Holy cow! What an incredible score! You wiped the floor with me! Well, I did have to pull out all the stops. Ah, the cats! I really don't think I, I can top that one. Don't be silly. If you keep practicing, I'm sure you'll get even an even better score. The more you play a game, the better you get at it. Unless you're me, in which case somehow I find myself always getting worse at it. That's kind of you to say. I'll keep doing my best. Oh, about that thing. That music better stop it right now. Yeah, you sure you want to go through with this? Well, I can't do it right now. I'll take some preparation. Can I get you to come back later? 
Sure, I guess you need to work up some courage. I get it. I'll be back later. Thanks, I'm so excited! I can hardly wait! I don't like where this is going. I, we, we all know that this isn't going where they're implying. It's going to be another bait and switch because Kiryu's luck with women is always horrible. I wonder if Luca is ready for me to write her now. <clears throat> she is talking about writing her, right? What else could she mean by that? <clears throat> Kirisan, I'm ready for you. You are? Uh, um, don't worry, I'll... Huh? I spoke with the manager and got him to order one of these sweet rides I was talking about. Super Hang On! It's the hot new motorcycle racing game, Super Hang On. <laughs> the Dean! That's also a good reaction from Kiryu. What's the matter? Don't you like motorcycle racing? I love games like this. I thought you'd want to go for a ride. Oh, sorry. I just... It just wasn't what I was expecting. It's fine. It seems like a sweet ride. Oh, haha. <laughs> Great. I really pushed the manager for it, so I'd feel terrible if nobody wanted to play. Hop on whenever you want. Yeah, I will. Super hang on, huh? It looks like fun. Hey, Luka-chan. Can you help me over here for a second? Sure thing. I'm coming right now. Well, you have a good time then, Kiryu-san. I look forward to talking more about racing games sometime. It looks so sad! Damn it, I kind of want to just give Kiryu a hug. I guess this is the only action I'll be getting tonight. <laughs> Cool, we can now play Super Hang On. It's so sad. That That is the look of a man full of nothing but disappointment. Alright, can I actually buy this place now? Ugh, the cats! The cats! Yep, she's still here. Oh, Kiri-san, I heard from the manager at Yurikaze that you work in real estate. Yeah, that's right. I don't suppose you'd be interested in managing this place, too, would you? Huh? You really want me to? Sure, it'd be a pleasure. Great, I don't know about the details, but all the financial dealings in Kamurocho are making it hard to keep a store afloat here. The manager was complaining earlier. With someone trustworthy like you handling it, we'll feel a lot better. Thank you for helping out. Alright, there we go. We got all the places now. And this place definitely needs some investment. Holy hell, that actually brought us up quite a bit. Alright, we'll do one of Super Hang On and then we'll head back to the office. And then I'll actually start the counter because I forgot to do so. You better score by the end of this and not a high score. <laughs> Alright, what were the controls? Insert coin, accelerate, turbo switch, brake. Okay. Wait. Oh, the triggers also do it. Alright, we'll go with the beginner. All right, we'll go with that one. Oh, God. Yeah, this is a lot different.
Ah, my knee! Ah, it looks so painful. Oh boy, oh boy. Out of the way, guys. Oh, too far, too far! Come on! Ah! So close. Alright, that's actually a bit funner than the original, uh, bride. Alright. Nick the end of the sign. Yeah, that, I think that sign costed us that, uh, next checkpoint. Alright, first things first, let me get uh, the timer started, and let me get Kokoms on, because I know these two want to get in. It begins. Uh, the the beginning of my madness. <laughs> hey, you you brought it up, hey, if I donate 10 bucks, you get, you'll wait for uh, half an hour. To be honest, it actually was lo longer than half an hour because I decided to save it until we were done there. Well, we didn't, didn't really walk too much, though. So. Oh, we still we still walked in that cutscene. <laughs> I'm gonna go insane. <laughs> Dragon, have I ever told you you're bad with money at times? Uh, I've heard that from many people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I I can't uh, judge because I spend money on bad things as well. Mm-hmm. Uh, we got big trouble in the Pleasure King area, so we'll have to go sort that out. That is very unpleasurable. <sighs> Stocks! Oh. <laughs> the whole sequence in the arcade. Oh, God. You gotta feel bad for Kiryu at times. Man just wants a good night out. He can't get a good night out. His friend betrayed him. Who betrayed him? His best friend, remember? Nishiki? Yeah. He didn't betray him. He he was he honestly thought he was gonna do cure you a service because of the horrible things that the family was gonna do if uh they caught him. Hmm. So misunderstanding. It, it's a it's not a misunderstanding, it's more of I can't see a person that I look to as a brother suffer the way I've seen other people suffer. So I'm going to just have to kill you here. At least it'll be a quick and painless death instead of a long, drawn-out and painful death. Mm -hmm. You could saw how broken up he was over it. Yeah. I still say that the double circle love is going to be libido. <laughs> At this point, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> it's this game. I'm just all right. Uh, I'm just wondering who the double circle for shopping is, because we haven't found them yet. Uh, have you met anyone in general you think would be good at that? Not that we've run into yet. Mm -hmm. Everybody that we've run into in a side story is already a part of the firm. That's someone new to me. Yeah, if I can find them. <laughs> might be someone in the Pleasure King area, but or we might have to beat the electronics first. Mm. Alright, this place can still make a profit. Nugget's already working on the gambling. You gave the chicken a gambling addiction? Yes, I did give the chicken a... No, I gave him a... I gave him collection in a gambling area. There's a difference. <laughs> uh, we have a bet of 20 eggs. Sir, that's not a uh, currency. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you're insane asking that much. <laughs> <laughs> Your dogs oh. are probably looking at you like, what the fuck? <laughs> No, Mar Marcy's looking at oh, me. Mr. Pre <laughs> Karma is just licking your paw. Oh, Mr. President, I'm sorry. Could you get the phone? 
Sure. Or even is a phone in this place? Oh, by the fax machine. Hello? Greetings, Kiryu-kun. That uh, voice, oh. the electronics king. What do you want? Nerd! Are you, free? Are you free? I'd love to hang out and play games with you. Again? Games are so much fun, so much more fun when you're playing against someone. Come on, humor me. I hear the arcade got a new who driving game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at my base, okay? I'll be waiting. No, 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 no. It's riding. Was that by chance the Electronics King? It's not the right gear you yeah, wanted. You want... <laughs> he wants me to play a game with him. I wonder what that means. Please be careful. Yeah. What's it mean by game? I got a bad feeling about this. You already know sure what he means by game. Now. Yeah, the game of death. Challenge to five billion years. Your properties and collection will stop. Defeat him and then we get our money. Fine, we're gonna disrespect him by beat him, beating him up with shoes that'll meow. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna mew all over his broken body, just like how that woman mewed all over Kiryu's broken soul. <laughs> There's a something going on in Ishiki's bar, so we'll have to stop by there. Oh, I'm crying. I don't know where we're supposed to go for the electronics key, unless it actually is uh, in Serena. Alright, so I was streaming Plants vs. Zombies earlier, and the night level wasn't as bad as I remember it. Uh, was it night level or night level plus fog? Uh, no, that's the pool. I got through the first two levels in the front yard, and now I'm in the backyard. Uh, oh. Hi, Reyna. You be careful out there. Not the only person who worries about you, you know. I guess there's nothing going on here. Can I get a drink? Nope. All right. I just remember here. I'm gonna guess by. Oops, sorry. I forgot to send the pictures I took of my dog saying the pet pics. I'm wondering if the Electronics King's uh, base is actually back at the Sega Arcade. Probably is. I mean, that's where we first ran into him, so it's a possibility. It makes the most sense. Which is going to be a little bit awkward, seeing as how I literally just bought the place out. <laughs> awkward. <laughs> Get a new hangout spot, nerd. Kira just comes in, he greases his hair back, cracks his knuckles. <laughs> yep, there he is. Oh no, is this what I think it might be? Hi, Kiryu-kun, thank you for coming by. Shall we get started? <laughs> God, that damn haircut. That Mo Howard haircut. <laughs> a fighting game, of course. It's I got this radical action pack PvP mode. Huh, you mean an actual fight? I'm better at fighting in real life than in video games, so that sounds perfect. Honestly, I was kind of hoping he was going to challenge me to a crane game battle. <laughs> We're going to bet anything this time? Yes, let's bet. All the properties that you and I own. Oh, shit. You mean all the properties that I own because you don't own anything anymore. Here's the deal. If you win, I give you all the properties in this area and log off the grid. If you lose, you give me all your properties. Sound fair? Just one catch. There's no guarantee that you'll still be alive if you lose. I may not look like much, but I'm strong. That's fine by me. I have no intention of losing either. <laughs> you'll regret this. Unbuttons his shirt and it's, he's just ripped under it. What, we're not doing this one-on-one? -on -one? That's how I would have preferred it, but unfortunately, I really have to make sure I win this time. You've put me in a tight spot, you see. I never calculated that I, a super gamer with an IQ of 190, would be put against a, a wall by some too big gangster. Maybe I just don't have much business acumen. This man is a walking Reddit poster. You know, No, this, this guy is literally gamers rise up. God. Yeah, he's he's Reddit meets 4chan. <laughs> oh, God. That's horrifying. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it's really annoying that someone else says it. Well, anyway. With a hint of Twitter. Thanks. <laughs> With a hint? I'm more like a dash. <laughs> Thanks for stealing my area. It was fun. But you know, you kind of went too far. I'm going to have to kill you and get it back. Remember, if you die in this game, you die in real life. What is this, SAO? 
Let's see if you can survive. Mew, mew, motherfucker. <laughs> All right, where are we going to fight? I, I hope we fight in the arcade. That'd be great. You swing an arcade machine at him? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I just ride around on the motorcycle arcade and run him over. Ah, uh, no, they took it outside. Yeah. All right, hold on. Hold on. Going for a ride. <laughs> oh, wow, he's got a lot of health. Well, duh, he's a boss. Doesn't look like he hits for shit, though. Yeah, but he's got a lot of buddies. We'll take him out. They're bonus points. I'm going for it. Not that's not what I want to cure you. I mean, it took out one, but I wanted to take out the others with him. Shit, he can kick your ass. I think he's in rush mode. That's not, all right. Oh, I don't have the heat on me. His that's why. dorky fighting stance. I'll harm you. <laughs> Alright, hold on. I got an idea. Here, come over here. Uh, let's see. Do I have it? Do you have it's the a, fish? It looks like a block team. I don't have the fish, unfortunately. Damn. Here, take the sign. <laughs> Alright. I think these are the same guys that jumped me outside the arcade last time we were dealing with them. <laughs> Probably his cronies. Because I remember this guy in the green jacket's stupid haircut. <laughs> My mom did this haircut. She did a horrible job on it. All right. Uh, I want some heat for this. All right, come here. Come here. Sure you want some heat earlier. No, don't. I'm sure the electronic king's on. mom did his hair too with the bowl. <laughs> oh, right into the back of the car. That's not what I wanted. Come on. The shoes. <laughs> I mean, I think they mewed when I stepped on his head, oh too. Oh, my God. Yes. All right. You know what? I'm going for Rush. Hey, at least you're making a little bit extra money with wearing them. Wow, he is a pain in the ass to hit. He's fast. It's a boxer, it looks like. Yeah, kickboxer. Yeah, put up your dukes. <laughs> well, you got plenty of healing items, right? Yeah, I do. That's just a war of attrition. Right. Break your hand. Oh? Break your face. Oh. And break your leg. Ow. Ow. Mew, mew, motherfucker. <laughs> He just kicked him in the nuts. <laughs> it's not like he's ever going to use them. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, it's not like Kiryu's ever going to use them either. Oh. Okay, that one just hurt. Maybe maybe in the future he might just... <laughs> no, because I think it's canon that Kiryu is a virgin. Even in the, the recent game. The poor man. <laughs> man just wants love. No, he just wants a break, because every time he's in the game, something terrible always happens to him. He wants both. He needs a girlfriend, Jesus, guy. get laid, and take a vacation. Alright, come here. Come here. Go for a throw. Go for it. No. Oh, it has to be against the wall. Alright, fine. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come for me. Come on. Come on, nerd. Ah, almost got it. <laughs> you don't need to go open the door. You can nudge your face in and push it open. You bulldoze everything else out of the way. All right. All right. You know what? All right. You're getting on my nerves. So I need to go get my trusty bike. He's just now getting on your nerves. <laughs> I can go for a ride earlier, but I'll make sure you go for a ride. <laughs> Uh, da -da -da, I need to do something now. Come on, get up. Get up, Kiryu. Give me that bicycle. Oh, use the plant. Right. You can pick up the plant. Oh, too late. Drop the bicycle on his face. Oh, it's not enough. 
All right. Uh, what? Oh, let's beat him with a plant. What? Well, let's beat him up with a plant. And he is out of here. <laughs> I, I get him with the dive kick. And now it's in quotes. Now the ultimate disrespect. Fanning myself with his money. Complete domination. <laughs> oh my god. He's that is such a power stance right there. Fanning himself. <laughs> that's gotta be a, that's gotta be a gif. <laughs> go for a ride earlier, but I'll make sure you go for a ride. <laughs> God damn it, dragon. <laughs> <laughs> you got some powerful specs there, Kiryu. You want another round? Yeah. I got plenty of bicycles. <laughs> no, I've had enough. You win. I'm out. As of right now, I'm pulling out of this area and Kamurocho money game. And you're all right with that? Not really, yeah, but I, I don't want my the, glasses broken. I yeah, I lost in business and got beat fighting too. It really doesn't make sense for me to go on. Even if I did, you'll just continue to get better than me. <laughs> All I did was grind for money to purchase more properties. But you devised a tactic to level up your businesses by micromanaging the time and resources you had available. And also buy up properties to maximize my business. In video games, the player who comes up with their own unique strategy can beat even the most practiced players. Your play style evolved as you went, so it's only natural you win. I don't think I did any of that, out of, anything out of the ordinary. I just did what I could. Heh. <laughs> well, I still got beat. I set a financial high score by investing in tech stocks. Then I got into this money game, and people who called me a nerd came to fear me as one of the five billionaires. I tried a lot of new things, but to tell you the truth, I'd rather play games in the arcade than sit around making billions of yen. I think I'm more suited to being a gamer than a billionaire. I see. Kiryu let's play again sometime, but next time, no betting. Yeah. I'm not motivated to play when there's nothing on the line. So how about betting on who play who pays for dinner? Heh, <laughs> <laughs> sounds like fun. I've learned my lesson that I have zero talent at running a business. I'll go back to being a gamer, but you know, I'd still love to help you out. And now he's a manager for us. Hi, Martin. And his best... Uh, wow, he's actually pretty good. He's got a two on the third day, and he's a four star. That makes sense. And he's actually pretty cheap. And his buddy's terrible on the first day, but pretty decent as the day goes on. Hi, Marley. I see you. I wish I could do more to help you, but I can't afford to be seen doing that. I need to lay low for a bit. Go lie down, Marley. Why is that? Oh, uh, you're better off not knowing. Let's just say. I betrayed the five billionaires, so now friendly fire is activated. You can probably imagine what kind of danger a traitor like me would be up against. You watch yourself too, Kiryu kun. Right. Wait. That suit. No, that's not who I think it is. No, he doesn't have to go T. Blocks have been unlocked for the rush style. Nice. It makes sense he was fighting us with Rush, and I think the, the other billionaire was fighting us with the Brawler style, so the third one that we take down is probably going to be in Beast mode. So what's the other okay. billionaire you're going after now? Probably Pleasure Next one we're going to go after is, yeah, Pleasure, because they're the next one on the line, and then Gambling, and then after we beat all them, the Final King will be unlocked. Who's the Final King? Like, what's his area? Uh, I'm going to guess... It it's going to be up here in this area where, like, the little Asia is. And judging by what his style was, I'm going to guess that his challenge is going to be Disco, which is going to be fun. <laughs> Alright, uh, we've got a lot of investing to do because we got a lot of money on us, so let's see what we can get. TBG. <laughs> yes? What if the one guy you're trying to be in Disco currently is the, tr is the uh, last king? No, because they already showed off all the kings when we beat the first one. Oh, okay. I know there was a place around here somewhere I could invest in. I just didn't have the money at the time. There it is. Jeez, that's a lot of money. Let's see that briefcase. Oh. It's weird. He, he picks and chooses when he gets that briefcase. Oh, God, this place. Oh, they're doing the yellow ring. I really don't want it. 
I really don't want to invest in this place. The things I do for a profit. Mm. I think libido's there often. God, I hope not. Then I don't want to hire him. Oh, there was some... What? Oh, there it is. The fucking shoes! Speaking of libido, we got another card, so he's gonna be around the corner somewhere. Wait, no, I remember. Wasn't he at the, the drugstore last time we saw him? Yeah, I think he was yeah. picking up uh, some healing items, I guess. Oh, no! No, it's him! We spoke his name one too many times <laughs> and he shows up! Yes! Uh, I screwed up. Oh, wait, sorry. <clears throat> uh, I screwed up. What's wrong? You seem a little... <laughs> down. I guess you could say you're a little flaccid. Good night, everybody! Bonk yourself. I deserve that. Mm, mm. Oh. Oh, hey, well, I went to a no-touching bikini bar, and I reached out and touched the dancer. So you got kicked out? I just couldn't help myself. The rule I guess is stated in the I, name. I guess self-control isn't one of your strengths. Anyway, are you getting any lately? God, I wish Tamu was here right now. <laughs> Kiryu doesn't get any. <laughs> well, there, there was this one chick at the arcade, and she asked me to ride with her, and then I thought, oh boy, is this my big chance? And then I realized, no, it's just for a motorcycle game, and I got really depressed. I need a minute. <laughs> Take her on to the motorcycle game. For. That's a fun way of doing it. <laughs> the, the vibration really makes me happy. <laughs> <laughs> you kidding? Then what are you doing in Camarocho, the land of sexy ladies? Is it? <sighs> Financial business? Duh. Let's see, for example, I saw this hostess in the hotel district. She was adorable, but there's this older guy always lurking around too. I think he's onto us. His name is Habu. I think he's one of us. Maybe I'll look for her if I feel like it. What it wouldn't give to get my hands on a video of a girl like her. I keep it under a locking key and treasure it forever and ever and ever. <laughs> Alright, you do you, buddy. Hmm. And don't do anyone else. How many diseases do you think he has? All of them. <laughs> I, I think a shorter list would be diseases that he doesn't have. TBG, that list doesn't exist. <laughs> Anything over here? Nope. God, how much time do- Okay, eight minutes on the cats. <laughs> TVG's going nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Mew, Mew, Mew. Oh, hey. Uh, ramen's perfect place for food for night after drinking. I have never had oh, ramen. I don't have enough for it. I've had, like, the, the, the store-bought ramen, which I hear is not that good. And, like, it's nowhere near as good as, like, traditional ramen. Which, I actually would like to try traditional ramen at some point. Food trucks. Have the best ramen. Uh, no. He move. Ah, damn. Mew, mew, motherfucker. Do the, do the shoes meow every time you get hit. <laughs> I, th I, the shoes meow when anything happens with Kiryu. I'll take that. The, the, these shoes are the Bonk. best thing you've ever gotten in this game. No, these are the worst things I ever got in this game. The best. <laughs> the worst. Yes, and that's why they're the best. <sighs> oh, God. I, I hate that heat move of you walk out of the way and he breaks his hand on a wall. It's so brutal. <laughs> When is Kiryu not brutal? Uh, when it comes to women. <laughs> Am I wrong? Mm. This guy looks good. Aha! A story. Okay. Got any telephone cards to show me? Oh. This is the telephone card guy. I mean, I got some cards, but not a complete set. I think those are libido right, cards, CBG. Get... No, it's a it's a completely different guy. The telephone cards are the the ones that had the women on it that we take to that one store. 
You think you'd be giving those to Libido? You think? I think in Majima's side, we give them to Libido. Alright, hold on. I need... Beast! Blow your inner lion. Ow. Jeez. Man, that lion's got a pit up for a war. They won't shut up. Holy shit. Well, this day this was a hard fight. Yeah, you're not wrong. It's just, it's not really hard. They just won't give me a s second to breathe so I can get a punch on them and get my heat move up. I think that's what makes it hard. <laughs> no, it's what makes it annoying. What's the difference? Annoying doesn't have to be hard. It can just be infuriating. <laughs> Alright, you know what? You know what? Grab you. Oh, I can't. All right, that works too, I guess. All right, I'm I'm getting a drink. Come here, buddy. There, you'll do. You spin me right round. Get out of my city. <laughs> Wait, who's left? Oh, you. Get out of here. Mm. Alright, uh, I might as well take a look and see what all the listing places are for this place. Alright, Pleasure Keen. We've got the ramen shop that we couldn't afford yet. Uh, yeah. Ariba Records. Uh, Quarter Layton. No Panties Barbecue. I don't know. And Moss Town Western Cuisine. You heard me. I heard you, but, uh, hmm. You heard me, but you couldn't believe me? Yes. Nope. There's something here. What did I walk into? Oh, this oh. is the Shogi place. Nope. Hmm. I'm not good when it comes to Shogi. <laughs> Mahjong, surprisingly, yes, even though I have no idea what I'm doing. Shogi, I'm horrible with. I, I've never even heard of it. <laughs> I... It's basically like Japanese chess, I think. Ah, I see. Ariba Records. They sell a lot of used records and CDs. What should I do? How much is this place? It is $156 million. They got this. They got this record called The Cries of a Thousand Soldiers. Damn it. All right, how far is this place stretched to? Cutoff point for it is the street. Ah, great. We keep seeing this guy in a raincoat. I don't know. I don't like it. Usually when you wear a raincoat in Japan, it's a bad sign. Or that's what every Japanese horror movie that I've uh, seen say. <laughs> or you know, just... Japanese horror movies. <laughs> or you just look at six. Or you just play Little Nightmares. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, Moon, the comics me and you found on the App Store, that was mm -hmm. just to promote Little Nightmares 2. There's a whole, like, physical comic series. But I think the dev said it's no longer canon. Nah, yeah, it was just I, I saw that after I was like, oh damn it! Wow, what a dumbass! <laughs> he just fell over. Had a few tomato drink there, bud. Where's your friend? Oh, he. I guess I kicked his ass. Money, money, money. <laughs> Alright. Up against the wall. Oh, God! <laughs> Jesus oh, jeez! Holy shit, Kiryu! <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah, my head hurts just by watching that. Uh, I hurt all over again. From... Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> I think of the pawn shops right here. I can sell these plates. Imagine cure you as a masseuse. 
No, thank you. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Majima's the masseuse. I'll take Majima. <laughs> Libido as a masseuse. Uh, God, no. 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 No, 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 no. <laughs> no. <laughs> what can I buy here? Uh, let's get some medicine. It's worse. It's both of them. No. God. God. Okay, here's the question. Which libido? The one who seems to keep his hands to himself but never wears any clothes, or the one who wears clothes but can't keep his hands to himself? Yes. No. 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 <laughs> no. That's a big no. Danger zone. Danger zone. I need an adult. <laughs> they are adults. What? Shut up. <laughs> Oh, Marshall. I need an adult adult. They are adult <laughs> adults. an adult adult. I need a bigger oh, adult. That one guy cared. <laughs> but Moon, I am a bigger adult. <laughs> where it counts. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you, you wolf. <laughs> don't, don't, don't worry. I hate myself, too. Oh, God. Oh, God. Do you need to go put some bleach in your mouth? <laughs> oh. Uh. I guess shot. oh, thank God. <laughs> uh, finally. Finally, the madness ends. I'm tempted to donate five bucks. <sighs> I'm safe. Now, where the hell are these last two places? You're still wearing them. Oh, did you unequip them? Yeah, I put the cow back on. Moo Moo uh, now? Great, a drunk guy. The cow, not cow. I honestly kind of feel bad for this guy. It's just a guy who's a little inebriated, but Jesus I just Christ the shit you. out of him with a sign. <laughs> I'm sorry. Please <laughs> forgive me. <laughs> the sign. <laughs> now go to sleep. <laughs> oh no. The libido has moved. No. No. The libido has shifted position. <clears throat> he did say something about the hotel district, and I think that was over here because the, the thing with the officer was in the hotel district. Oh, no. No more, mister. No. Not the libido. Yes, the libido. No. He shall rise. But well, he's always risen. Damn. The libido will rise again. TBG, he's always right, risen. Uh, all right, let's see. All right, so the records place is down by the, the main road. I think we all need a moment. The ramen shop's right there in that corner. So we're still looking for the quarter Layton, the barbecue place, and Moscow Western Cuisine. So maybe it's this place? No. Mm. Not great. I can't imagine how broken we're gonna get when. Uh... What the? Oh, oh. good Samaritan. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh God, that guy's got a nail bat. I can't imagine how broken we're gonna get once we get to the end of this series. Emotionally or, uh, no, just emotionally. Yes. <gasps> Look at the stride this guy's got. I mean, it's not oh gonna do any good because I just beat assassin. Give me that nail bat. Oh, God. Like you came to the wrong area, say. Oh, God. Oh, nail bat to the head. Mm. How has Kiryu not killed anyone? Because Cannon says so. Wow, this nail bat actually does a lot of damage to these guys. Holy hell. I think you hit your good Samaritan. No, he didn't. Uh, you, ah, you two just Come hugging on. it out over there? And stomp. Let me look at why uh, some people come help you fight. Like, maybe it's because I've been doing a lot of good in Camarocho and helping people out that they are more generous now? Maybe. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Alright, well. Uh, hold on, let me check back here. Maybe... One of the places to invest in would be back here, maybe, possibly? 
No, oh. not looking like it. TBG, the random guy is your security guard you hired from your real estate business and who will randomly joins you in the fight with you. Oh, oh so that's who those people are. <laughs> They're security guards. What? I know, but I thought the security was just uh, <laughs> to help out with the real estate. <laughs> that makes so much more sense. It hurts somebody. Hey, are you okay? I not feel good. Please. She's hurt. She can't even speak properly. What should I hand over? Uh, sure. Uh, take this. Uh, stamina. In. Here, take this. Oh, I feel much better. Thank you. What happened to you? It happened a little bit ago. I lost my job. Your job? Yeah, my job. My job for money. Oh, oh you mean your job. It's job, not job. My y job. I worked a sexy job, but I no take it anymore. I ran away from the sexy job, but owner, he catch me, and he roughed you up. He take my passport. I have no passport now. If the immigration find me now, I get kicked out of Japan. Then I ha can... Then I can no send money back to my family back at home. Passport? I assume you mean your passport. Yeah, passport. Some Japanese easy to say. Some not. I... I practice, but... This is hard speak. She does seem to have a problem pronouncing words with P sounds in them. I need Biza. Biza? Yeah, Biza. I have the Biza. I work good. I'd be happy. I'm not sure what you mean by Biza. I know how the Biza. Without the Biza, I ain't trouble. So I need the Biza, but I can't get the Biza so bad. I get that she wants a Biza, but what the heck is it? Are you wedding bells? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Hmm? If she's having trouble with the way the P sounds, that would mean Biza would be... Does she mean... Pizza? Kiryu, you, you idiot! Biza, pizza. That has to be it. The Biza she wants must be a pizza. She's been saying it over and over, she must have her mindset on this stuff. Yeah, I can get... I guess I can see how it would make you happy. Yes, everyone happy with the Biza. I want to be happy too. I get the visa. I work job. No visa, no job. Family, no eat. Is she trying to say visa? Yes. Yeah, it, it's a, it's a visa. Weird. Why would she need a pizza in order to work? That's why. She really I... must love pizza. Kiryu, you, you idiot! <laughs> That's also a pretty good uh, reaction shot right there. Maybe eating the stuff gives her the energy to get back in to work. That's some pizza passion right there. <laughs> you know where I can get a visa? Do I know where to get it? Sure, I think so. Oh, really? You know? Oh, okay, now yeah. I want pizza. <laughs> Don't they sell them around here? I've heard they even started to deliver them right to your house. That true? This country is so ab abut. Oh, ad advanced. I want to ask for your assist. Can you get me a pizza? What? Me? Need a pizza? Pizza costs money. I no got money. No money, no pizza. I think you got it the other way. Please, it, you get a visa? Easy for you to say. I was hurt and fell, and nobody came. You you only won. No, Japan, you're the only nice man. She said wedding bells because immigrants may marry to get a visa to live in the States. Ah. Mm-hmm. The only one I can ask for, please give me the visa. All right, fine, we'll get her a visa. This girl can work again if she eats some pizza. All right. If all that, if all, that's all it takes, why not help her out? Okay. I'll see what I can do. Oh, you do it for me? Thank you very much. Then I work, and then I'd be happy. I had a visa once. Now my visa time gone. No more left. Well, I guess you'll have to get through it before it gets bad. Sorry, I no got money for visa. You take this, please. <laughs> Hearing Biza just made me think of this video I just sent to Art. <laughs> oh no. Oh. 
I think that would be more towards a uh, game chat dragon. All right. Oh, I'm thinking of green card. You have to marry to get a green card. A visa is just a temporary uh, card for you to be in a country, country. somewhere. To, to, to work, I think. Yes. Uh, uh, sure, I'm Kiryu. You can count on me. Kiryu-san, thank you. Now, where do I find a pizza? It's Western food, so maybe a burger joint will carry it. Smile Burger might work. Ah, uh, yes. The, the famous pizza burger. Actually, to the, be fair, that actually does exist. The burger? Yes, there it is. The, the Papa Jones, the pan burger pizza. Blech. And I'm sure it sounds absolutely horrible. I have never had it, and I never will. I need a stiff drink. This is one of Japan's top brandies. This bestseller has one of her countless people with its bright, fruity aroma and smooth taste. As for the name, Visab stands for Very Superior Old Pale. Oh. Speaking of drink, I need a drink right now. TPG, you're on stream. All right, let's go get that visa. <laughs> That's some strong moonshine. Was that a pun? Suntory. <laughs> Suntory uh, Koromaru Sochu is an exquisite blend of two types of Sochu, one rich and strong, and the other light and full of fruity aromas. A unique variety of sweet potato from the Kagoshima region gives it a mild flavor and refreshing clean, uh, clean finish. So fresh and so clean? Oh. <laughs> so fresh and so clean. Zestfully clean. <laughs> oh, no, I couldn't. All right, now I'm good and hammered. Let's go get a pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go I get want a pizza with everything on it. I want a double deluxe, damn it. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Where is this place? Extra anchovies. <laughs> Takoyaki, soba new. Oh, God, that's actually quite a ways away. Jeez, and wants me to go all the way there and come back here. All right. This and don't go in the barbecue and... sauce. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, no, please, no. Don't ever say pizza with barbecue sauce. There is a chicken buffalo pizza. Yeah, I've had that before. It's good. No yeah, uh, I had a terrible experience with pizza and barbecue sauce. Swass. Where. Swass, yes, swass. <laughs> uh, where I just ordered a simple cheese pizza, and for whatever reason, as soon as I bit into it, I almost threw up because they replaced the regular sauce with barbecue sauce. Where did you order this pizza from? From a pizza joint that you stack up together and knock over. What? <laughs> Domino's. Oh, oh. oh. Well, no wonder. It's Domino's. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't really like Domino's. I hate Domino's. It makes me sick every time I eat it. One place I don't really care for is Antonio's. Never heard, Never of, heard of that one. It's probably just in my area then. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Back alley. All right. A really good pizza place, though, is uh, Ohio Pie. Yeah. Never heard of it. Uh, they're, uh, when you get pepperoni pizza, they put little devs of sauce into the pepperonis. Mm. Mm. That hungry foreign woman, Samantha, asked me to get her uh, pizza. Might have some here. <laughs> I'll take a pizza to go. The most popular one. Um, did you say pizza? This is a burger shop. You don't have pizza? Big yeah. Bubble Galaxy. What? Look at the soda machine. Once the treasure gets back. Oh. You know, pizza then? I thought you had all sorts of western food. <laughs> I would like to take a gulp of some big bubble galaxy drink. I'm sorry, you might have better luck looking for pizza in the pizzeria. Pizzeria, huh? K Was there one in Camarocho? Cure you. You didn't think to look for a pizzeria well, first. Well, you could try pizza la. Pizzala? You order over the phone and they deliver it right away. It's very convenient. Incredible. Can you call this uh, Pizzala person and ask if they can get me a pizza? Pizzala is the name of the pizza place, not a person. I guess it doesn't matter. I can call them for you. How about a special combination pizza? The large one is three. Jeez, 3,000 yen. 
That's like oh. 30 bucks there. Yeah, um, is that 30 bucks? Let me see. I'm I think a thousand yen cost, uh, translates to 10 bucks US. 3,000 yen to USD is $27.37. That's pretty. Jeez, that is one expensive pizza. That is a typical cost that's of a pizza. just for the pizza. Plus delivery. No, usually, when, whenever I get a pizza, it's usually like maybe like 20 bucks, not 27. Maybe that's well, why you're getting sticks for waiting. pizza. All I had to do was make a phone call and they delivered. Wow, time sure have changed. Please enjoy your pizza while it's fresh and steaming hot. Some food is better cold, but certainly not pizza. Bullshit. Cold. Shut up. <laughs> Got it. Thanks, I appreciate it. No, no, never a problem. Please enjoy it while it's hot. Next time, please try one of our famous hamburgers. Sure. Okay, I have to get this pizza to Samantha while it's hot. Better hurry. <laughs> I, I completely disagree with this pizza man. And pizza is best. Oh hope. no! Oh no! Kiryu, why are you moving so slow? Alright, hold on. We need a fitting music for this. Pizza theme, pizza theme, pizza theme, pizza theme. Normally I would save this for when someone uh, dropped the things for the alert, but instead. <laughs> pizza time! <laughs> this is such a cursed stream. I can make it worse than you can put the shoes back on. Well, see, it's how I killed the sound in the game because there actually is a song playing for it. Oh, God! What's going on with the camera? I can't control it. It's the left trigger to change ch camera angles. <laughs> this is some intense pizza delivery scene. Am I going the right way? <laughs> oh, no. This is getting a white suit Thankfully. with the pizza. <laughs> oh god, imagine the grease skiing on Kiryu too. Oh no, no, I don't want to think about it. <laughs> That'd be a tough stain to get out. I I just throw the suit away at that point. <laughs> but with the power of OxyClean. Oh shit, I missed! There's my turn. I I need to make a left here. No, I need to make a right here. Alright, let's get back to the game. My god. Oh my lord. At least no one was trying to kick my ass while I was delivering this pizza. Why is it so slow? Out of the way, sir! I need to deliver a pizza to a woman! I think she only has nine seconds before it goes cold! I think he, he's trying not to jostle it too much and drop it. <laughs> like the opposite of the Spider-Man uh, 2 minigame? <laughs> <laughs> Where you had to swing to deliver pizza, but if you did flips, it actually ruins the pizza and you had to do it again. Yeah. Hey, Samantha. you, son I got what you asked for. Oh, you did? Heh. <laughs> it wasn't easy. After all, it is worthless if it's not fresh and hot. Thank oh. you very much. <laughs> it's no good if it expires. Huh? Did you just get the P sound right? Hi. Yes, for job. I've been practicing. Now I can pronounce Japanese P and V sounds. Uh-oh. I see. Good job. Uh-oh. Thank you so much, so... Oh, right. Yeah. I wasn't sure what you'd like, so I ordered something safe. It looked really good in the picture. Oh, picture? You need a, my picture? Huh? You have a picture of what you wanted? Oh, Sorry, I, poor I got it kind of close. <sighs> He's too innocent for this world. Just a dumbass. <laughs> I'm He's sorry. a dumbass, but we love oh, him. If it's if it, oh, if it's close, it should be good. Oh, Lord. Curious on. You're really not. You're a really nice Japanese. This first time a Japanese man so nice to me. Heh, good to hear. Kiryu-san, I work hard, work and work until what you gave me expire. Not until expires. What? Well, it'll probably go bad pretty fast. Expire fast? Why? What do you mean? Well, how long could it possibly last? Uh a day, maybe. A day? No, oh, no, Kiryu-san, that's not so good. Don't get me wrong, I'm not an expert like you are. But then again, it may be different here in Japan than from your country, Samantha. Oh, I see. Maybe Japan different. Okay, take this and good luck with your job. <laughs> Look at this face! Kiryu-san! <laughs> no, you don't have to share it. It's all yours. Enjoy. So... Um... Damn it, that actually looks like pretty good pizza right there. 
Ah, uh, yes, I love. Only if it's cutting the triangles, though, not not the not cutting the squares because I hate it when uh, places do that. It's awkward to eat the squares when it comes to the crust. It's awkward to eat the center ones. Because there's no crust. The there's no crust to lift your finger on. Exactly. So I have to like move a fork underneath it to just scoop it out like it's a pancake. <laughs> uh, this pizza. I need a visa. Huh? But but S Samantha, you said you wanted pizza so you could eat and fill your fill and get back to work. No, that's not really what I say. How will I work with pizza? Uh oh. I think I really screwed up. No shit, Kiryu. I thought she wanted pizza, but she was really saying Visa. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> yeah, don't say. Yo, Samantha, it's time. Uh oh. Uh -oh. What is this? Why is he wearing a carpet suit? Did you get that suit from the hotel lobby? <laughs> Definitely. Hotel lobby suit. Damn. Who is this? This man, he make me do sexy work. I run away. What? Samantha, don't forget. You made me a promise. If you get a visa by the deadline, you get your passport back. And then you can leave this job. But if you don't, you're promised to work for me for the rest of your life. Um, will you take this? <laughs> That's a tasty pizza right there. <laughs> Wild Eyed Creep, I just saw what his name is. Huh? This is a pizza, not a visa. There's no one on this planet who wouldn't make that stupid of a mistake. <laughs> no. Oh, oh. Kiryu. you. <laughs> Samantha's in trouble, and it's all because of my pizza. That's also a good line out of context. Oh, you should have fucking sc screenshot that when you can after the stream. Uh, I'll get it when I get the VOD. Come on, Samantha, move your ass. We'll get you back to work and raking in the dough again. Oh, excuse yes. me. Can you please slam Hold the pizza it. in his face like Squidward, Squidward did to that one guy? <laughs> well, this one's on the house! <laughs> it burns! Hold it. Huh? What do you want? <laughs> Sounds like your gig is working foreign girls illegally. And? How does this concern you? Well, I feel kind of responsible for this mix-up, so I, wanna, I want you to let Samantha go. What? Wait, are you and Samantha... You better not be touching my merchandise. Oh boy. N no, there's nothing going on here. There was just a little mistake, that's all. You calling my girl a mistake? I'm gonna kick that pizza so far up your ass you'll taste the pepperoni. That's a good line, actually. <laughs> that's also a pretty good line. Uh, Damn it, I don't see a pizza anywhere. I am happy my Omori stickers are on the way. Just imagine one of those crates or boxes being a pizza. If we get the pizza after this, I'll be happy. The pizza's a weapon. Yes! <laughs> you throw like a frisbee. Got it stone cold. I I see where I need Alright, you know what? Forget it. Trash can it is. Well, this is home. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Looks like he's in rush mode. Yeah, I see it, but I want to get a grip on him because he likes guarding my attacks. Or drop a trash can on his head. That works too. Bonk. Ooh, get out of here. Oof. Can we all admire how strong Kiryu is? He's able to shatter a trash can against someone's skull on impact. He's shown many feats of strength, and we it impressed us all every time. <laughs> Shit, this guy's for real. Samantha, you're done taking orders from him. If you want a visa, apply properly like you're supposed to. I'll teach you how, okay? I'm gonna want that Here pizza back, too. Hey, Samantha's passport. Give it back to her. I can't. What? I... S Samantha, don't leave me. I have to tell you, really, I... I... I love you. Bullshit. Bull. What? so crazy about you. I took your passport so you couldn't leave the parlor. I couldn't stand the thought of you going away. No, you, he does not get the sappy music. Bull. I'm sorry for everything. Just just don't leave me. If you have it in your heart to forgive me, please marry me. Wow, wow, <laughs> he <laughs> is 
This is going a million miles in like three seconds. Poor <laughs> thing. <laughs> but marry you? If you marry me, you can work in Japan without a visa. You can even keep wiring money to your family back home. See? But I do not want to do more sexy work. Of course not. I wouldn't force my wife to sell her body. Samantha, believe me. I'll find you legit work. I'm begging you, please forgive me. Don't do it, Samantha. And be by my side, please, Samantha. Don't do it, Samantha. It's a trap. <laughs> what do you want to do, Samantha? This man, he did bad things to me, but... Ah, oh, you idiot. He's the only one who taken a woman like me and give me a job. When I was feeling lonely, lonely, he talked to me. Samantha. Back home, my family's still waiting. Still hungry. I have to work in Japan, so... <sighs> I will marry him, Kiryu. You think it's okay? That's for you to decide. If you think it's for the best, I certainly won't eject. Thank you, Kiryu. You. If you even look at Samantha Ron again, I'll make you regret it. I will shove that pizza so far up your ass you'll be tasting pepperoni. This is me right now. Better make her happy. <laughs> what, Kiryu? No. <laughs> Just look in chat, chat. Game chat. Oh. Uh. What? Oh. <laughs> I, 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 yes, sir. Kiryu-san, thank you very much. This, my thanks. Security wallet? Mm -hmm. Ah, it's that new bridge wallet that everyone tried to sell on YouTube. Are those any good? Heavy space? I don't know. This wallet drastically reduces the amount of money you lose when get shaken down. It's also said to give you financial luck. But isn't Mr. Shakedown gone, or is he still around? He's still around. I, I think I just beat him last time we saw him, so the one that's marching around right now is one that doesn't have as much money on it. Ah. You sure? Of course. Okay. Let's eat it while it's still fresh. Good pizza's like a new marriage. Enjoy it while it's hot. Okay, we eat. Yeah, let's have some. Spills it on his suit. Wow, he just gulped it down in one go. Let's all eat pizza in a back alleyway. Totally not. Jeez. Why is the pizza guy watching us? At least at the end of the day, the dumb mistake I made tastes better than a visa, right? Yes, Kiryu-san. Your visa is number one in the world. That pizza guy's like the ultimate wingman. Okay, well that was definitely... Interesting. Something. Interesting. Interesting is a word for it. Not sure if it's the word I'd use, but it was a word. Why was the pizza guy just staring at everybody at the end? I, I, have, I have no idea why the pizza guy was there. Oh, great. The men in black are back. What is this guy doing? Oh, you broke my pipe. How dare you, sir? Send him down the pipeline, then. Did someone say pipeline? Oh, no. Don't. Did somebody say pipe? Oh, God. <laughs> Get out of here. Jeez. I can't take any more Mr. Libido. <laughs> He can take it all. Why you, Why do all the girls say that? <laughs> oh, I'm horrible. We're both horrible. We're all horrible. I'm screaming on the inside. Oh, eternally. <laughs> Alright. All right, I need to go to a safe spot to drop off all these things that I don't need. Where is there a taxi around here? Taxi? Alright, up by the park. Taxi! You get into it, suddenly GTA 5 loads, and you can steal the cat, steal the taxi. Okay, there we go. Now I can store weapons. Oh, there's a couple things that... 
Master Ball, this weapon can apply enough force to knock you out your average foe. It could also catch Mewtwo. Huh? I'm gonna put my fish and my guns away until I can figure out how I'm supposed to be able to fix this stuff. I got a big festival fan, don't know where I got that. That be, that's so weird out contest. I gotta put my fish and my guns away. <laughs> and my fish who was also a gun. Fishy fishy. Alright, uh, I'm gonna put that sacrifice stone away. Uh let's see. The weights cause the 998, yeah, I'm putting that away. Same with the shirt. Restores health while standing still in battle. I never stand still in battle, so there's no reason for me to have that. Quick change, I'll put that away. Power to see. Said the residing spell it gives you incredible strength when throwing opponents, so that might still be good to have later. Increase heating when I'm in a jam. Energy reserves when I'm close to death. Raises your financial luck slightly, and when you when shaken down, you can stash money inside, reducing the amount taken from you. I'm going to replace the secret wallet. I think the security wallet's actually an upgraded version of it. It's weird that we haven't come across Shakedown lately. Uh, you probably just stunned him. Honestly, one of his places to go is the park, so I was expecting him to be sleeping up here, but nope. Someone closest to work, I guess, there. Yeah, I'm looking at Omo Cat's uh, tweet on the new merch drop, and there's so many people like lamenting they couldn't get to it in time because a lot of stuff is already sold out. <laughs> so literally, the second you woke up, is just like, all right, I'm getting this. You know, I, I, it Ooh, was really ten minutes after the drop. I noticed the I was still doing stream. I noticed that the merch drop happened, so I stopped stream for a second to go buy the merch. You bet. Oh, is it a one-time thing? Hmm, I guess so. Wow, that is a lot of damage, though. Uh, I'll take the big fast festival fan. And you know what I'm gonna do? Gonna... If Limited Run announces a physical collector's edition Mori for Switch, I'm gonna order that, too. I, I feel like a Mori would be a game that gets ported to the Switch at some point. It, it is getting ported to the Switch. You gotta announce for Switch. Ah, cool. Can't wait for that Amori amiibo to come out. <laughs> oh, Mr. President, we reached a 30% share of the Pleasure King area. Speaking of amiibos, the, wow, uh, already? the Byleth, Terry, and Banjo-Kazooie amiibos are out. So, uh, guess who got the uh, Banjo-Kazooie and Byleth amiibo? <laughs> I didn't see Terry today. Banjo-Kazooie are, Banjo are on my list, but not right now. Yeah, I actually, I could probably... Uh, Take a picture and show it off the the banjo one I got. That's great, the Pleasure King. That's the muscular one in a dress, right? Yes, the billionaire who controls the area around Pink Street. He made his fortune on telephone clubs and other adult-oriented business. Oh, I know what what the challenge for this one's going to be. A woman's soul inside a man's body. Maybe he's found success because he understands what both men and women want. Understanding the desires and instincts of men and women that probably enabled him to figure out how to s simulate. People's desires for profit from it. Someone who converts desires into a business, huh? Impressive. Yes, he certainly is impressive, but he seems to be engaged in a fairly nasty business as well. Ripping off customers is a given, and he buys and sells the girls who work at his business. I haven't heard anything good about his business practices. Also, I hear about girls disappearing the next day after getting into an argument with a Pleasure King. That does sound suspicious. Is he connected to any criminal or crim eh, criminal organizations? The area is full of hooligans from back in the day, but it seems the Pleasure King controls them now. After spreading around money and providing women, they now do his bidding without question. I see, so the Pleasure King basically has those hooligans by their wallets and their balls. Gotta give him credit for understanding what makes men tick. <coughs> oh, sorry. There's no doubt he's a tough opponent. I have no clue what he's going to do, but please be careful. Uh. Will do. Pleasure King. Someone who harnesses the desires for the sake of business. This won't be easy. 
But you know what it is easy? Collect the money. <laughs> I'm gonna be getting nothing from this because it's just straight up static. Mm -hmm. Oh crap, money battle. Oh god, uh, the person I have is a one star. Whew. I'm scrolling Twitter. What is it I'm seeing about King Shark? Oh, the new Suicide Squad uh, trailer came out. Uh, the Red Band. Okay. K uh, King Shark's apparently a uh, character in that, and also voiced by Stallone of all people. Sylvester Stallone? As someone. Yes. Wow. Alright, I need someone better. Uh, he is horrible except for the second day. Nugget's already busy. Leisure Kane's good to go, though, so I'll put him back in there. I'll keep Taka there, though. Alright, staff here. Yeah, they definitely need to be swapped out. Electronics, I'll put him in charge of his own area. Uh, I think that, yeah, that's his, his buddy. So I'll put him back in charge of his area. I think Nugget needs a break. Yeah, Nugget does. <laughs> Still can't believe you named the chicken Nugget. <laughs> it's better than Nuggies. I had Nuggies for dinner tonight, actually. I hate, I hate you. <laughs> I had chicken strips for dinner tonight. I had chicken tenders for dinner tonight. Oh my god, we all had chicken. Poor Nugget. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking, I, I, I was scrolling a... Uh... McDonald's on DoorDash. I was having trouble finding the ten piece. All I was seeing was the forty feet, forty piece combo. Jesus. All right. Well, the World Theater is finally level uh, C. Art place that is shopping, and I still don't have anyone good with shopping. So you. I actually do have enough to buy maybe two places there. Phone's going to die. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see. Get that. <laughs> you know what? I'll do it just so we can get this up to A. Or close to A. Mm -hmm. Alright, a size S rank now. Kyo, no, not you! Not you! Oh no! Alright, sushi is now S rank. Mama, if you would. The lovely bunny is now S rank. And so is the Chinese eatery. God, no! No! I get scared every time the fortune teller comes up. <laughs> it's just like, I'm going to accidentally use her to invest, and then I'm just going to be like, oh! Alright, uh, let's see. Electronics work in that. Leisure's work in his own area. So I'll have him collect money there. Let's work on... Oh, we already got pleasure. But we do need to swap out the staff, so who do we got? Uh, Casca, I guess. And Koshimitsu. I'm gonna have to take Casca off after, after the second collection, though. Alright. Come on, let me see something real quick. Uh, staff list. Oh, that just tells me where everybody is. Store list. Imagine if Nugget wasn't on duty, he was just sitting in one of the chairs. <laughs> Honestly, I, I want Art of Nugget just in a little tie, just going through files, trying to make a case for why you would want to invest in uh, Kiryu real estate. It's a chicken. There's nothing more that needs to be said. Exactly. How many CP do I have? Do yes, I got 20. He makes the big bucks. 
Get out of here. Get out. <laughs> You're banned. <laughs> You clucking mad? I'm gonna cluck you up. <laughs> I feel like Moon's going into your corner. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna let you guys just brawl. Oh, it my out. security's here. <laughs> and he's gone. Ah, not enough though. Oh, Jesus Christ! The, the good thing about the oh, it's only one guy. I think. I think he actually kicked someone else's ass. My security dude, I think it was like Koshimitsu. Yeah, it's your. It's the one that we were like, come on, we like you. Yep. All right, CP. Bob, hear I you? I want click collection. All right, now that that is done, we should. Uh, I think that like drastically reduces the time that collection goes. Or can I actually see collection? Oh, yeah, I can check it here. Electrox is almost at 100% too. Alright, so right now I just want to do some scouting to figure out where the barbecue place and the uh, the Russian uh, food place is. Because I have no clue. Thank you for wasting troops, Dragon. <laughs> This guy in the raincoat, he is everywhere. Nah, he's only in this one area. I haven't seen him anywhere else. Maybe it's on here. Nope, that's a pachinko parlor. Would it be here? No, here? Nope. And that's uh, Don Quixote. Uh, so a few weeks ago, I was uh, scrolling YouTube, and I found a video. Someone made a wooden puppet of the hunter. Oh, from Little Nightmares? Yeah. Oh, cool. You have to drop that in art. I would like to see that. Uh, should be easy to find. Uh, Rainer Hut Camarocho. That's the ramen shop. That's the bar. And that's Earth Angel. We already... Taking care of that. Maybe it's somewhere around here. No. Oh, that's no, the record place. And I can just barely not afford it. <laughs> what is this place, Ranger Hut? What kind of Rainer Hut? What would you like? All right, it's an art. Oh, this is just noodles. Well, this guy. Wow, that actually looks really good. <laughs> I, th I think he based it off like actual like old like wooden puppets his parents had. Uh, what was the, was the the Little Nightmares like? Uh, animated series is that going to be uh, stop motion I, puppeteering? I believe it's going to be stop motion. Okay. Oh wait, did we find it? Did we find? No wait, this is the shogi place. Damn, where the hell is this location? Location, location, location. All right, that's a parking garage, and I can't invest in that. Foreign food. I want foreign food, damn it. Oh. I found something. What did I find? I'm scared. <gasps> nope. Where are there different courses? Oh, it's a telephone club. TOS. TOS. No, the telephone club's not the TOS breaking one. Oh. The other places. That's the one where we got our date that we can like go bowling with and uh, sing karaoke with. Oh, okay. Ah, there it is. It was right next door. <laughs> ah, I took one. Yeah, we can afford it, so I'll much. get it. Huh. All right, there we go. Now all we're missing is the barbecue place, the 
the ramen shop uh, and the record store, I believe. Yeah, barbecue. Oh, the Latin, uh, the Latin as well. I don't even know what a Latin is. Hmm. I really wish. Oh wait, no, oh, that's the ramen place. I really wish they would mark it on your map, but they expect you to just smear your face across every storefront until you find it. Oh, what is this place? Oh, this is the the ramen shop Kiryu and Ishiki were in at the start of the game. <sighs> I'll find this place sooner or later. Most likely later. The Latina is a sail on a ship. So, probably seafood then. Aye. Aye, Captain? Hmm. I'm trying to think what would look like a seafood restaurant around here. I'm drawing a blank. So how much more do you need to take this guy down? Well, we just started. We haven't even done the first challenge yet, or we haven't even met them yet. What the hell is this challenge going to be? <laughs> Probably, if I had to guess, it would be the, the phone club thing that we did. <laughs> what if it's the other club? Oh, no. The no-touch bikini? <laughs> <laughs> There we go. That's what I wanted. Oh, you're still alive. I can fix that. No, no, he's still not. He's still conscious. Remember, Kiryu didn't kill. Oh, right. He's not conscious anymore. Now he isn't. Oh, no. Alright, stamina. I was kind of hoping for a plate. Karma is snoring. And that is adorable. All right, at this point, I'll, I'll take wherever the hell this... What's it called? Kiryu's getting desperate. The the courtier Latin. If you can figure out where it is, I'm all, all ears. Like, you can just say what street it's on, and then I'll be able to narrow it down. <laughs> Not there. Who's this guy in the white suit who keeps running around like he has a chicken with his head cut off? Oh. Kiryu turns on, you don't say shit about Nugget. <laughs> What'd you say about my feathered son? <laughs> Kiryu doesn't have a fur baby, he has a feather baby. I have feather babies. Okay, that's fair. Okay, he has a clucking baby. It's still a feather baby. <laughs> I mean, both chickens and parakeets are birds. Yeah. Alright, well, I'm gonna sing Judgment while you guys figure out where this one place is. Time to sand out my frustration! <laughs> Mostly because I really like this song. Yeah, we know. Wanna, know a, wanna know a fun fact about uh, Toucans? Hmm. They actually eat other birds and uh, raid nests for eggs. Mm hmm So do starlings. <laughs> God, the, the whole ones are just so weird to do with the timing because of the second delay. So you listen through XSplit for the audio. Yes, so there's like a second delay. I just listen through the Elgato program.
<laughs> this whole sequence. I can't. I have to share this because it's just too damn fucking funny. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, I've seen that. <laughs> <laughs> Girl's face. <laughs> what? <laughs> Got it. And that was probably probably my best run of judgment. <laughs> That's me whenever my cat pops up on my desk while I'm editing. <laughs> Just like, this is fine. Little asshole. <laughs> you good, Moon? No, I'm not. I've been a broken chick giggle wreck all day. <laughs> <laughs> when, are, when are you not, though? When I'm at work. <laughs> oh. right, I, I need to figure out. <sighs> That angle looks like there's a guy approaching you. Oh, you're approaching me? <laughs> well, I can't buy real estate without getting closer. Well, then come as close as you'd like. <laughs> uh, this place? Okay, it's down by the street with uh, the taxi cab. Which means it should be right down there. God, how many times have we- Oh no, he's back! Oh. Hmm? <laughs> I screwed no! up. No! Again? Run. Oh, it's the same stuff. Alright. Nope. Sucks to be you. Wait, it, that says Camarocho Asian Beauty Show. Is this it? So is this area just all cabarets and stuff? Probably. Yeah, I think it's like all cabarets, all like uh, lingerie places. That's why this is the Pleasure King section. Where the? Mm. And Nick here, you still can't get any. Shit. <laughs> 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 It says it should be right here. I don't like that. I don't like that. That sign says Joy Boy. <laughs> I don't. I don't like it either. I don't like this guy in the yellow raincoat. I, I think he's supposed to be a crier for the place because you know it's supposed to be a seafood restaurant, so he's like a a fisherman. If I can ever find the damn place, like holy shit! Has he had a hook, line, and sinker? Get out. <laughs> Oh, cool. A million yen shiitake. So, mushrooms? <laughs> so, that's a 10 yes. buck mushroom you just bought. No, it, 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 10 million yen. Yeah, so in so so USD, a, that'd be $10. No, that would be a million, uh, $100. Damn. Oh. 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 No, act no, actually, that'd be $1,000. That was one. That, that mushroom. Better be making you go on a big trip. You you spent a million uh, yen, right? Yes. A million yen to business. U.S. dollars is nine thousand one hundred and twenty-two and eighty cents. <gasps> so almost ten thousand dollars. Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm sorry, but don't mind me. I, cure you. What's wrong? You've you haven't even touched your ten ten thousand uh, dollar shiitake mushroom. I have to. I'm sorry, but that just that was a waste of troops for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Let me add on to that. You are bad influences, you know that. You bought <laughs> almost a ten ten thousand dollar mushroom. Because when I did the million yen with cure with uh, Majima, I got a gold ass shotgun that one shots almost every enemy. That was with Majima. Majima has good luck with that stuff. Kiryu can't even get a lady. <laughs> He's got a point, TBG. 
God damn it! You know what? He, he actually does have a. Point. He thought he he thought he a lady meant pizza when she meant visa. Yeah, true. Kiryu is, is a bit of an idiot. He, I think he's had too many hits to the head, too many concussions, too many stabs. Mm hmm. Is that the? No, it's the pager, Kiryu. What do you think? See what I mean? You, you know what? You might be onto something, Dragon. <laughs> Yes, hello? Oh, our president? Please hold on a moment. Mr. President, someone named Maori-san is asking for you. I'm not here. Maori? I don't know anyone by that name. Hello? Hello, are you Kiryu-san, the president? Yes, and who might you be? I'm with the Criminal Investigation Department of the Regional Taxation- Oh, no. Are we getting arrested for tax evasion? A tax inspector? Yes, are you familiar with us? All I know that is that investors from the Regional Taxation Bureau do all kinds of things that go after tax cheats who can't be caught by normal audits. Mm -hmm. Yes, we go by Marusa. I'm surprised you've heard of us. So what does Marusa want with me? I'd love to have a chat with you, Kiryu-san. I'm thinking about dropping by in the near future. What do you mean by chat? Oh boy. I'll discuss things in more detail when we meet. Uh, oh, that's probably... and I have my hair in a, in a bob. Please remember that so you can spot me when I visit. Got okay. a feeling that's a pleasure, King. Tamo pops in. Did somebody say bob? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I didn't Tax take a drink. From... <laughs> a tax inspector from Marusa. What does she want with me? Oh, no, this isn't the main story. This is a sub story. Oh. What's the matter, Mr. President? Are you okay? Well, isn't this whole, uh, uh yeah. isn't this whole, like, business thing a sub story? It's this B story. Uh, it's not a sub story. Like, the, the thing with the pizza visa thing, that's a sub story. This is Kiryu's B story in, uh, line with the, his A story, which is the main plot. Pizza visa, say that five times fast. Pizza visa, pizza visa, pizza visa, pizza visa, pizza visa. Ten times. Pizza visa, 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 pizza visa. Got it. You screwed up at the end. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. You said visa, visa. No, I said pizza visa. No, you didn't. Do it faster. All right. Sound like pizza. All right then. You asked for it. Oh no. Oh dear. Pizza visa, 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 pizza visa. You loved your middle. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. The mom will say otherwise. Yes, you did. The mom will prove me right. No, I won't. Faster. No. God, my actually, I need a drink because that one actually hurt my throat. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious! And I'm gonna eat this slice of pizza visa. Is it pizza with visas on it? <laughs> yes. Ew. No, it's a, it, it's actually a pizza shaped in a visa. <laughs> At any rate, a woman from with a bobbed haircut is going to come for the regional taxation bureau. Guess I'll find out what she wants. When I talk to her, I've heard you like oh, God, that actually... writing. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. Oh, gambling is in trouble now. All right. Thankfully, money is going to be going up in this area, so we shall just start right there. Get the payout from there, and it's going to go up for. Quite a bit after this one, the next one. Unfortunately, this one is down, but at least it's going to go up to, I believe, two. Yes. But then we're going to have to swap out Kasuga almost immediately. Oh, invest. <clears throat> Once this is all said and what done, you have all the VODs uploaded. You just need to, like, go through them and just, like, take the best moments and make a video Shit, out of it. Shit, I knew I was gonna do it! 
I knew I was gonna accidentally collect, uh, select her. What? Oh! <laughs> She foresaw it. <laughs> she foresaw my bankruptcy? Yes. Alright, Kyo. Never play Uno with her. <laughs> <laughs> She'll reverse it. <laughs> Mama, you got this. And this. And Kyo. And I still don't have anyone good for shopping. Got Mama for food. Masochistic for business. And that's... Oh, wait. Can I... Okay, I've already invested and I, I can't get the investment until I beat up those guys that are causing trouble. Alright. Well, I'm going to take a break because we've almost been going for two and a half hours. Oh, now. God, we have. So, <laughs> uh, God. Plus, I need I need to get some more water to, you know, actually not die of dehydration. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we'll do the sub story when we get back. In the meantime, uh, here's some gifts. All right. I'll be right back. <clears throat> I don't think any other game has made us laugh this hard, this consistently. Mm. Mario Origami King did pretty good, though. Yeah. <laughs> Sly series also did pretty good, especially when we got to Sly 4 and we met Bob. Yes, Bob. Bob broke us. <laughs> Now I'm just remembering that one person who came to chat and uh, was getting on to us about nitpicking the game when we were pointing out stuff we liked. Yeah, that's why I was like, can we just boot him? <laughs> <laughs> I still don't know where TBG finds half of these gifts. Probably has like a... He's got a gift dealer. <laughs> like the top right one. Where the hell is that from? Which one? The one with the dinosaurs. That looks like it's from G.I. Joe. Yeah, they kind of those the... guys kind of they look like Cobra, Cobra soldiers. Yeah. How I know that? Don't ask. And once you once you take a look, it kind of gives it away. Okay, now where the hell did he get that top middle gif? I'm guessing that is from Private Ryan. Saving Private Ryan, and I don't know the anime. <laughs> I think the Vegeta one is from uh, when Beerus first got introduced. I didn't watch Dragon Ball Z much growing up. I could, I, I hated it. <laughs> I watched more Dragon Ball Z abridged. I just couldn't get into it. I got, I, I watched Sailor Moon. <clears throat> <laughs> I just wasn't really much of an anime kid, and I think a reason why, uh, I think I was like what six years old. I was up late watching uh, TV. And for some reason, I was on Adult Swim, and they were doing a, a tsunami hour for Adult Swim, and they played mm. Spirited Away. Spirited Away on Adult Swim? Yeah, it was during their tsunami hour, where like they played the more adult animes. But that's Studio Ghibli. That shouldn't be adult. Yeah. I don't know if it was... I, I just know it was tsunami, and they were playing... Uh, spirited away and it freaked me out and just kept me away from anime for the longest time <laughs> so I'm back to spirit away scaring you away from anime what? <laughs> I was six years I was six years old 
It was late at night. Toonami was playing, and they were playing Spirited Away, and it scared me. Okay. <laughs> I mean, yeah, there, there's some, uh, like, some creepy imagery in it, but I'm surprised it was something that scared you away from anime. I don't know. It's like every time I saw anime, it just like the it just reminded me of it, and I was like, nope. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Where's your back to the daily grind? He was asking like where that the top middle gif was from. I figured the uh, the real Pat part was saving Private Ryan. Uh, the no, that's uh a compilation. Uh, that's a like a combination of uh, what was it, Keijo? It's literally a anime about fighting using your butt <laughs> and fury. It's the it's the tank movie with Brad Pitt. Already, I then. need a minute. I need a minute. I need a minute. I'm bro. Look it up. No, Look it up. I don't want to. Look I'm, it up. No, I'm not doing that. I will not. <laughs> hmm? Did someone say butts? Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like she's wearing a mask. Like one of those creepy, like, doll masks. Yes. <laughs> What's this odd-looking woman doing? Is she checking out the office? She looks like the porcelain doll kids from Little Nightmares 2. <laughs> You're not wrong. Come to think of it, there was a call, a woman in a bobbed haircut coming from the Regional Taxation Bureau. So, the woman must be from the Investigation Department, M Masura. They're the taxation experts that investigate companies for tax evasion. She's one of them. It's like her, her mouth is painted on. It's like her whole face is painted. Fucking scary looking. I don't like <laughs> it. I got a bad feeling about this. H hey, are you maybe... What is it? Are you, uh... M Marusa? Marusa? What do you mean by Marusa? Well, you have a bob haircut. You must be the woman who called me, aren't you? What are you saying? I'm not Marusa. My name's kind of close, but... No, wait, let me guess. Marissa. I'm hungry. Well, that was completely random. I'm the one from Marusa Kiryu-san. You are? Yes, sorry for not introducing myself sooner. I'm Agent... Mari of the Regional Taxation Bureau's Criminal Investigation Department, a.k.a. Mar uh, Marusa. So you're the one who called me. You wanted to talk to me about something? Yes, I was hoping to ask you something, Kiryu-san. What is that? Would you go on a date with me? <coughs> Kiryu-san, I need your assistance in a delicate matter. What kind of assistance? You mean Marusa needs help? Precisely. Kiryu-san, have you had any dealings with your neighbor... Maguro Enterprise in the office next door. Kiri, you're about to get your heart broken again. I'm sorry, bud. <laughs> no, I don't know the name of the business until now. Good. That's ideal. We're investigating M Maguro Enterprises for tax evasion. Apparently, this uh, fellow by the name of Yoshi works there, and he's been evading us for years now. <laughs> we finally found him. Really? Tax evasion? Shh, keep it down. We were tipped off on Maguro's infraction by an informant who has dealings with them. Our source promised to deliver evidence to back it up, but then we lost all contact. Your source might have been si silenced forever. I'm afraid so. I need to get on. I need to get the goods on Maguro Enterprise, but if I did it myself, Maguro might notice a stranger sniffing around and become suspicious. But if you were to you were to be seen with me, his next-door neighbor, your presence can be explained. That's why you want me my help with this. Nice. I couldn't have put it better. You catch on fast. Yeah. I get the picture, but I don't really have much of a stake in this. Nope, you're not obliged in any way. But if you were to offer assistance, you won't regret it. In more ways than one, I would think. Cure you. Please, don't... What's that supposed to Don't mean? be thinking about it again. You're taking on the five billionaires, right? That's on top of figuring out how to run a business. Not too easy for you, is it? How do you know that? I'm with Marissa, remember? That's not that's nothing compared to the kind of information we work with. Here's the deal. Help me, and I'll help you with your business. Not a bad deal, is it? 
You're serious? Yep, I know the industry inside out. My support's invaluable. What do you say? When we get done, she's hired as a security officer. <laughs> True. So, decision time. Will you help me investigate Maguro Enterprises quietly? Well, duh. We need all the help we can get. Fine. Tax evasion is a serious crime. I'll do my part for the good of society. Good. We have a deal. Time to punch people. <laughs> so, just an average Tuesday hey. for him. Hey, Marusa lady. Yes, Kiryu-san? By the way, I told you. My name is Mari. Why, why are the cameras so close to our mouths? Oh. Mari-san, you're, uh, kind of close. It's a brilliant cover, though. By pretending to be a couple, we can loiter without arousing suspicion. Oh, Kiryu, uh, no. All right. Ah. What's the matter, Mari-san? Shh, quiet. It's Maguro. The head honcho of Maguro Enterprises is coming. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Hey, he's staring at us. It's okay, we're just a couple on a date. Yes, but just go with it. Kiryu-kun, I love you. Huh? Hey, what gives all of a sudden? I don't love her. Play along, will you? We have to convince him we're a couple in love. Come on, Kiryu-san. We need to perform. Declare your love going for a kid. Which one should we go go for? Gaze at her adamantly, or declare my love, or go for a We kiss? all know which one Kiryu would re realistically go for. Gaze at her? No. Declare? No. Ah, uh, fine. <laughs> Mari son, I, I can't hold back anymore. What? Cure you? Up oh, there's that saxophone. S stop that! Slow down! I'm not ready for, to take this step! N hey, Mari son. Sorry, it's been so long since I've been with anyone. I didn't need to know that, but I overdid the acting thing. Sorry. Wait, what about Maguro? Hey, buddy. It's a process, you know. You can't just jump to the best parts. Uh, yeah. At least he's not suspicious. Huh? Wait a second. You're... Uh-oh. Does he suspect something? Yeah, you're from the office next door, aren't you? I've seen you going in and out. Uh, yeah. I'm Kiryu. I was recently put in charge here. Sorry for not introducing myself sooner. I'm a girl. I'm a. I'm in real estate, and no, I should have introduced myself sooner too. Anyway, Kiryu-san, I'm impressed that you're the man in charge at such a young age. You must bring a lot to the table. No, it really was just circumstantial. Ah, <laughs> modest too. Listen, may I invite you to my office for some tea? I'd like to get to know my neighbor. Gets him in a headlock, gives him a noogie. <laughs> oh, what? I shouldn't be interrupting your fun. Sorry, that was inconsiderate of me. Interrupting our fun? Oh. President Maguro, please pay me no heed. I'm President Kiryu's secretary, after all. Hmm? What? Hey, Kiryu? You're dating your own secretary? That must be nice. <laughs> now I really want to get to know you better, Kiryu. Please, do me a... Uh, do come by for a visit. This guy's making me uncomfortable, and that's saying something Give him libido. <laughs> I don't know. Kiryu-san, this is a perfect opportunity. Huh? You've gained entry to, into Maguro Enterprises. I know you were the right man for the job, Kiryu-san. Oh, right. That's true, but what's what if your cover's blown? Danger comes with the territory. I'll do whatever it takes to expose Maguro's shady dealings. Heh, <laughs> got it. I'm in this with you till the end. Is something wrong? Yeah. No, no, we're just saying we should take you up on your offer and visit your office. I see, I see. Then, please, this way. He is totally going to poison us, or try to poison us. Oops, there's no one here. The staff and even my secretary are out. No matter, I can prepare the tea myself. Have a seat and make yourself comfortable. Heat. I like it hot and steamy. Okay, hot and steamy it shall be. 
He doesn't have staff, does he? Probably not. There's a chance to search the office. He's gonna come back and try either give us the tea and it's probably gonna be poisoned or I don't know. Something's gonna happen and our cover's gonna be blown and we're gonna need to kick his ass. Are you sure about this, Maurice son? There's no telling when my girl will come back. Curious son, tell me, what's he doing now? Making her tea? A standard teapot capacity is between 40, 400 to 600 milliliters. To prepare the tea for free for three and some refills, he would need two pots, so he needs to boil a liter of water. To boil a liter of water in a kettle takes about four minutes on high heat. That man is likely that man likely gets his secretary to make tea, so he'll need time finding the tea leaves. All in all, we have about seven minutes to conduct the search before he returns with our tea. Follow? But sir, is something else. This is so much Masura. This isn't so much Masura as it is common sense. Also, rather than working those gums, how about getting busy? I doubt financial statements would mean anything to you, curious son. Look for anything suspicious instead. <laughs> Got it. TBG. Like the Daruma doll back there? TBG, I, uh. I thought of something worse than being poisoned or being found out. What? The tea gets spilled on a, on a suit. Oh, no. Not the suit! Not that pearly white suit. Hmm, this video rack. There's something odd about it. It's location, video collection, its presence. Uh, its video collection? Oi. Don't you think this video collection is strange? The videos here he has here, what about them? Hmm, as far as I can tell, the videos all seem to be standard stuff. Beyond that, I don't have any opinion to offer. What about them struck you as odd? No, I guess I got carried away. This kind of instinct can be valuable. If something bugs you, check it thoroughly. Lockers are locked. The four tiles are broken, probably just from wear. Sofa looks comfortable, but there's nothing suspicious about it. Well, documents and books, they don't appear to be suspicious. There's a talisman to ward off evil behind the calendar. Is this place okay? Pile of magazines, my girl seems to be a man of many interests. Did someone say magazines? Dharma. <laughs> a Dharma and Prancing Stallions. The man's got taste. Oh, I thought the Dharma doll would be it. There's gotta be something that, in that cabinet. Nah, it has to be the videotapes. How about its location? Oh. Hmm, doesn't look like out of place. Nope, that's not it. Alright, uh, let's try... It's presence. True, we're, we're, there's a thing with videos, but there's no TV in here. There's nothing wrong with the video rack itself, but this it's strange that it's in this room at all. <laughs> It being here is odd. Oh, you're right. There's all these videos, but neither a TV nor a VCR to play them on. Right. It's too bulky to just be placed here on a temporary basis. Besides, there's dust here that shows it hasn't been moved recently. There's something clearly unnatural about this video rack. <laughs> Curious on. That's our. That's on the money. They must be hiding something in these videotapes. To think he would hide evidence in plain sight in his office. My girl is bold, I'll give him that. So if you were to examine these videotapes. Curious on, sorry, but can you open the door for me? I'm holding the tray. Uh sure, I'll get it. He's quicker than expected. What do we do? You know where to look now, but so maybe we should come back another time. No, I can't risk having him move the evidence. We're settling this now. Yeah, but my girl's back. We can't keep searching. True, I don't have any choice. It's time for the last resort. The last resort? <laughs> Sorry to keep you folks waiting. I usually get my secretary to serve tea, so I had to track down the tea leaves. Uh, thank you very much. Oh, it's Speaking green of, tea. If that spells on Kiryu suit. Oh, no, it's ruined forever. Why isn't your secretary taking a seat? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry for any awkwardness. I threw out my back, and sitting is simply agonizing. 
Ouch. That's rough. I know how bad it is to throw out your back. Yeah, so I'd much prefer to stand. Please don't mind me. Remember what I just told you, Kiryu-san. Keep my girl focused on you while I examine the video cassettes. There's no way this is gonna work. He's sure to notice. You do it, Kiryu. You're a man with the balls to do this, and Masura gets, gets the men by their balls. That made no sense! Are we speaking telepathy? I guess. Ooh, whoa. What's wrong? Can't 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 take your eyes off each other? Oh oh no, it's nothing. Uh it must be nice to be young to be in love like that. Anyways, Kiri-san, if you don't mind me asking, how did you get in to be in charge of your own office at such a young age? Well, it's a little complicated. I was approached by this man. <laughs> wow, she is really going at it! Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait. Oh my Oh my fucking god. <laughs> now, let's see. That's, uh... <laughs> the longer you leave it on screen, the stupider it looks. Come on, where is it? <laughs> it works so well! Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, I see. It's amazing how a single chance meeting can change your life completely, isn't it? It doesn't help she kind of looks like Velma. Distracted. My glasses. I can't be seen without my glasses. Oh wait, that's Johnny Bravo. I can't see without my glasses. No, but there was a crossover with Johnny Bravo and I know. I I, I have a DVD of it. Oh. Okay. That that's just one of my favorite jokes from that. <laughs> huh? You think so? It's just. Something seems to be distracting you a lot. What's bothering you? That booty. Uh, well, mm, I thought I saw something. That, that'll make him suspicious. Dodging the question is definitely going to uh, make him suspicious. I, I guess we'll go with that booty. Yeah. Watching Missouri Sun's body wiggle I around. I am proud of you, Kiryu. Damn it, Kiryu, that's the wrong thing to say! <laughs> you mean your secretary? Come on, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> Looks like she's just standing there. How oh, right. You just you just can't keep your eyes off her, can you? You know what that can be like when there's not much else on your mind. Okay, so don't say anything about the secretary. Uh, Alright. I, I just figured just being like uh, something's distracting you. And it's just like, I saw something, he'll look and be like, oh, what was it? Or if I dodge the question talking about a suit, he'll be suspicious. So I figured, oh, it's just m my secretary that I'm completely in love with. Oh, uh, yeah, that's what it is. I'm, uh, totally in love. <laughs> hey, Kiryu! Why would you distract, direct his attention my way? Sorry, he caught me off guard. Don't let it happen again. Got it. Kiri son, I have to tell you, I'm impressed by how well your business is doing. Oh, I don't think we're doing anything too differently. How modest of you. I wish your success would rub off on us next door. The world being the way it is, the one with the money wins. It doesn't matter how they get it either. It doesn't matter at all. Hmm? Oh, excuse me. I got lost in my own thoughts there. Tell me, Kiryu-san, you're obviously well off, but is there anything you still want? It's something I want. Let's see. A VCR, women, a house, maybe? Women. No, because he'd be like, why do you need women? You already got a secretary you're in love with. And a VCR would be him referring to the tapes. Yeah, so definitely has to be a house. Oh, a house, you say? What sort of property are you considering? Hmm, you really pe perked up there. Oh, right, of course, you're in real estate. This man's suit is stock, uh, stock background. <laughs> it kind of is. <laughs> you forgot that comprehensive support for finding your dream property. You get it all at Maguro Enterprises. So, what areas are you considering for your new home? 
Do you want a single family home or a condo? How much floor space would you like? Well, let's see. I'm never going to get tired of this joke. <laughs> there, I kept my girl's attention focused on me. Missouri son, hurry! Well, I must be say, I am glad to finally meet you, Kiryu san. I enjoy chatting with you, too. Uh, yeah. Same here. The girl's trying to wrap things up. Is Missouri son done? <clears throat> she wants more time? Oh, boy. Easy for her to say. Well, Kiryu san, I enjoyed your visit, but I should be getting back to work now. Maguro san. Yes. How do I buy more time? Uh, that'd be too weird. That wouldn't make sense. Ask for a handshake, I guess? A girl son, before I go, may I shake hands with you? <laughs> shake hands? Why, of course! Here's to a fruitful relationship. <laughs> Oh, yes, I hope so. I very much hope so. Just keep shaking. Do you ever have shaking. any good tips for me? I'd love to get into it. <laughs> you know, this is also pretty good gift material. <laughs> um, Kiryu-san, can we, uh... We're gonna be next-door neighbors for a long time. You can let go now. Kiryu, you're not even shaking his hand! He is let go! He's not even shaking his hand now! <laughs> He's just bobbing his hand up and down! Uh, yeah, Kiryu-san, agreed, but you've got quite a grip, Tiger. Can I have my hand back now? <laughs> no, can we stay this way? Just a little while longer. <laughs> Are you fantasizing about something, Kiryu-san? <laughs> Good, I can buy her some more time. Now pull him in for a kiss! Oh, God. Well, Kiryu-san, thank you for visiting. It's already been Feel three hours, anytime. Jesus. Uh, yeah. There, gotcha. This is it. What? President Maguro, I found this bank, this blank book and videotape. Interestingly, these numbers don't seem to match the revenue features on your tax findings. Oh, why are you blowing our cover now? Wait until we're, at least we're gone. What? That's you. Are you from Masura? Or Marusa? I was merely invited along as Kiryu-san's friend, but yes, coincidentally, I do happen to work for the Criminal Investigation Department of Regional Taxation Bureau. That is a mouthful. Mm -hmm. It is. That's why they have acronyms. I'm rather dismayed that I stumbled upon evidence of your tax evasion on my private time. D damn you! I'll kill you! You want to consider the consequences first? If you kill me, you're guaranteed a life sentence. Stay on your best behavior, and you might be lucky enough to get a parole in 30 years. How old, how old will you be then? If you're willing to stay caged that long. Go ahead, kill me. Yeah. What was that little jitter he was doing? The whole scenario is just weird. Mm -hmm. All these side stories have been weird. This is the weirdest so far, at least for Kiryu. I don't know. The, the the visa one was pretty weird. That was just a simple misunderstanding. It got really weird when uh, oh. the dude showed up. Okay, how about Kiryu fantasizing about the girl who worked at the arcade? That's just horny. <laughs> I like how casually you just say that. <laughs> That's just horny. Am I wrong? <laughs> gotta, give, gotta give Kiryu the bonk for that one. <laughs> Kiryu-san, thanks to you, we got evidence of... Of Maguro's tax evasion. I think I broke food. <laughs> you did a great job keeping Maguro's attention away from me. You did better than I could have hoped. <laughs> Just doing my part for the country. Like I promised, I'll help you with your business. Of course, I will expect to be compensated fairly. What? It's not for free? Of course not. Besides, it's peanuts to you. In this day and age, money f is flowing like water. I feel like I got the short end of the stick. Alright, she's an advisor. 
She's good with business. Damn, is she expensive, though. That makes sense. Ah, Kiryu-san. Make sure your office keeps on filing your tax prop taxes properly. Got it? No argument for me. I just got a first-hand demonstration of how scary Masura can be. You know what? Crime doesn't pay. This is for you, as thanks for your help. I want should, you to have it. Should he mention he was the Yakuza at one point? Oh, the Trouble Finder! Yes, finally! That's to find the sub-stories for Kiryu. Watch your back. Masura lurks everywhere, sniffing around wherever dirty money leaves its stench. You never know. Missouri could be watching you, out of sight, but never far away. They could even be disguised as a pizza delivery guy. This player like is like a, a detective soap opera. What the I feel incredibly uncomfortable right I now. Like a cold the fuck? Chill just went down my spine. I think she's another agent who's watching over Kiryu's uh, place. Oh, good lord. Doesn't make it any less creepy, though. It's not creepy. Alright, so now that we got the Trouble Finder, we can now see sub-stories. Hopefully Kiryu doesn't have to deal with Karen. Mm. Oh. oh, no. We, I, I think he's dealt with at least one in a sub-story. I don't... Yeah, the, the woman who... No, wait, no. She wasn't technically a Karen, just a dumbass kid. <laughs> And another and one lady was just working for an MLM. Yeah, honestly, I don't think Kiryu's dealt with a caring yet. Yet. Keyword yet. Uh oh. I am not losing this place. And we all know what happened with Majima when he dealt with his. Oh god. I don't want to remember. If you can, you still need to put her on the floor as a joke. I know. But when we haven't been as Majima in a good while now. I know, I'm saying when you do get back to Majima. Alright, we'll put him in investing. You know what really sucks is the fact that a lot of things in the Pleasure District are love-related stuff. Well, duh. <laughs> I know, but still. Also, damn, we got a lot of money. Uh, have you upgraded Curie in a while? I haven't. I'm really just focusing on buying a property. That way, once we get uh, all the property and all the billionaires taken care of, we can just start collecting money without having to worry about investing or wasting it on money battles. Hmm. So maybe I'll dedicate a day to just grinding up money while I'm off street. Damn it! I didn't want her. You did it again? I did it again. Alright, well that's everything there. Alright, Kasuga, you gotta go because you've got terrible uh, luck with this now. Let's put... Who do we have... Uh, let's put Nugget back in there. Nugget gonna make those Nuggies. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Electronics is good for one more day. Or one more collection. And Leisure is good for two more collections. But his security needs to be replaced. All right, in the meantime, I uh, might as well head up to the gambling area so I can take care of the goons up there. So does Majima really want to go back to the Yakuza now, now that they've tried to frame him, or no? They're not trying... Kiryu is the one who's getting framed. Majima's not being framed. He was basically told to do a job if he wants to get back into it. He hasn't been framed. Mm. It's just that he's really torn on doing it because... Oh, I see a card. He's just torn on doing it because A, something's off about everyone wanting uh, to either take Makoto or uh, kill Makoto. Mm. And B, she's not who he was initially told was the target. He's... Uh, 
Lee was was better fit the district the description of who he was supposed to take out. Yeah. So the fact that they, they lied to him about it means that he's suspicious as to why they decide to lie about it. And the first family you dealt with the Dojima family, right? Uh, with Kiryu, it's the Dojima family. With Majima, it's the... I don't remember the family's name, but it was the guy with the red suit that was a complete and total sleaze at his uh, cabaret. Oh, there was blood in Kiryu's suit for a second. From fighting? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. All right. Uh... Should we go do more side? Oh, right. I was supposed to go fight those guys up in the gambling district. I say we go see if we can... How much money do I have? I have enough to buy up possibly one, maybe two properties. So let's go do that. And then we'll do some more side stories until we can uh, invest more. Oh, no. He's back. No. What's taking her? Come on. Come on. You. What are you doing here? Hey, buddy. What's it look like I'm doing? I'm waiting for my date. I met her through a telephone club. Oh, really? Nice. I met my date the same way. She's late, though. It's already been half an hour. What's taking her? Anyway, are you getting any lately? That's not what I'm here for. Not everyone's like you. I was offered a ride, but it was a misunderstanding. <laughs> then what are you doing in camera? Oh, it's the same thing. He's just appearing in weird locations. Up oh, there, shakedown. It's been a while since we've seen that guy, but he's only carrying seven million on him. Not worth it. Ah, damn it! You know what's bad though? What? Mm -hmm. He's walking down the same street that the guys that I had to take care of to reopen the district. Well, just keep behind him. Yeah, just don't let him see. You. Well, it's the thing. It's it's a one way street. Well, then don't go down the street just yet. Uh, well, here's the problem. I don't. All right, you know what? I'm gonna get into this fight. Maybe it'll. Uh, I think he spotted you. Don't worry. He takes his time getting to me. Oh, all right. Ow. Jeez. Break your hand on that air. Oh, you know what? I want to see what this does. Fan! Alright, I have to know. Heat move. Please tell me this has a heat move. No, it does not. Damn it. Alright, well, that was fun. <laughs> Big fan. Get out of my city. Okay, hopefully Shakedown is gone. It looks like it. Alright, yeah, he, he bolted. Oh, hey, check it out. That's a bat. Don't worry, it's not going to do him any good. Where's your bodyguard and you need him? Yeah, probably taking a break. <laughs> Can you blame the poor guy? <laughs> His boss is always getting into fights. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Alright, you with the suit. Uh, which one? I'm gonna drop you on your friend. Yes. <laughs> Pile driver. <laughs> I, I just saw the one with the weird looking striped suit on grabbing his knee, and all I thought about was Peter Griffin. <sighs> My leg. Ah. <sighs> oh! 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 No! Who? What? what? What the heck? Here you why? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. 
Ooh, that deserves dang. the bonk sound effect. Uh, no, that that deserves you the atomic bonk. You stomped his nuts. <laughs> eh, he wasn't using them. <laughs> Neither was Kiryu. He can't have babies anymore. <clears throat> oh no, what a shame. The higher goon har harassing my people can't have kids. <laughs> what will the world come to? Ah, oh, damn it. So many goons out tonight. They want that curry piece of Kiryu. They can have the trash instead. What's the difference? Are you calling Kiryu trash? No. <laughs> I mean, he's trash with the women. Uh, <laughs> pile driver! Mm, God, that is the worst I have seen <laughs> Kiryu do with oh heat Oh my boost. god. <laughs> That's making my neck hurt. <laughs> Nick at the top of my head. I'm pretty hurt. sure it hurt his neck even more. Uh oh. Just need to end the whole pile driver sound effects. Uh, God, every time I see it, it just hurts my head. Think about the guy who's getting his head pounded into the cement. I don't want to. So that's uh... Curious New Jackhammer. <laughs> <laughs> Like, it's ridiculous how brutal Kiryu gets at times. At one point, he's like, just gonna grab someone by the legs and start using them as a weapon. He, not the spinning thing, just grabs them and starts swinging them, and you're in normal, like, fighting mode. Uh, actually, it's funny you say that. I think in a future Yakuza game, there is actually a move that you can give Kiryu where he will grab opponents by the leg and just swing them around. Oh my god. <laughs> That'd be great. Alright, now, where the... Alright, you... You're obviously selling fish. I want to buy your fish place. It's Vegas. Yep. It's so Give bright. Give fish. Damn it. All right. Uh, let's go and buy the record place then. You know, he know what it could also be? Could be. It's just a thought. He's in a pleasure district. Maybe he's trying to promote God. Sin. Have you, all you sinners, have you decided to re revoke your sins and accept our Lord Poseidon? <coughs> Why else would he be in a fisherman uh, raincoat? I wouldn't be a Lord Poseidon, I'd be worshipping. Neptune? <laughs> no. Have you heard of our Lord and Savior, Cthulhu? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, right, the barbecue place. Where the hell is that place? Uh, did any of you guys watch uh, Sir Palo on YouTube? No. Mm -mm. Uh, he, he's an animator, but he's like, you can tell like he's heavily from like, the new ground scene, given how his humor and his animation style is. Mm -hmm. But, uh, All right, let's... and, uh, he, uh, two of his characters, Skid and Pump, they're in Friday Night Funkin', and, like, a few days ago, he posted some artwork saying Friday Night Funkin' should have boss battles. And it looks like Ow. a fight against Cthulhu in a tuxedo. Oh, wait a second. This is so <sighs> Mori. I want that. I want... To... Right, damn it, I can't see... All right, there's a corner shot back there. That I think that might be the... Let me see if I can find it. The, the, the Western food, though. I think we've already invested in this place. It fucking hurt. Ow, ow, ow. You okay? Uh, did you get pile drive by Kiryu or something? Oh, I've got a cramp in my ass. <laughs> what? TMI, Moon. You ass. <laughs> okay, maybe I can't do anything until I progress in the Pleasure King stuff. All right. <laughs> Is this the... Uh, no, the telemarketing place. <laughs> Wow, there's a lot of stuff uh, in Pink Street North, so I might as well go there. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, that's, a, that's a telephone plate. No, that's not it.
Well, this looks like a seafood restaurant. <laughs> what, what was he trying to do? Just body check me? Mm. Kiryu, why do you gotta be so brutal? It's Kiryu. What do you expect? <laughs> He's a brute. Oh, one has got a knife. There we go. I, I found him. I'm sending into a, a game chat. Swing your body around. I think I took out three guys with that. Not the one I wanted, though. Alright, I know how to finish him off. With a stab! Just absolutely guts the guy, jeez. Alright, well, I guess I do need to progress before I can buy out this place. One well, the main story? Uh, I, th I think with the Pleasure King District. Uh -huh. A lot of people in gold suits tonight. I mean, I can't complain. They give me a lot of money. You get more if you wore those cat shoes. But at what cost? Uh, more money in your pocket. That's to your ears. And <laughs> all, all the all goes straight to therapy. Am I the only one who is not bothered by the mewing noise? You might not be, <laughs> but when you had to hear it over and over and over again for an about a half hour. I, just am I seriously non stop mewing? What's the password? Hmm? Sute G Kiro. He's speaking too quietly to catch to catch what he said. Good. What do you want? The usual. What's that about? Mew Mew TBG. Wow, check out my new bat slip. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> because it's funny. Vampires rule. I hate you. <laughs> Holy shit, it is only just about one. It feels like it's much later. Uh, it doesn't feel like we've been going for that long either. Actually, we've been going for almost three and a half hours. I know. Now, so it's usually. It's just because I started at nine. Mm. Which I kind of want to do when it comes to Yakuza, just because I want to dedicate more time to it. Yeah. Mm hmm. Hey, what are you selling here? Don't mind me. I'm just walking away. What's the password? Password? First time here? Sorry. Got nothing to sell if you don't know the password. Hmm. Weird business you run here. My merchandise is special. The kind of stores don't carry. Get someone to tell you the password if you want to do business. Oh no. Oh no. No. <laughs> I need a password, but I have no leads on where to get it. I guess this will forever be one of life's greatest mysteries. Like, how to get a date with a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Got what I needed now. That guy bought something. He must know the password. You got to chase him down. I'm going to have to track him down. Alright, he's actually just not that far away. Oh, it begins again. <laughs> yes. Hey, excuse me. You want something? I saw you saying a password to buy something from that guy. Can I get the password off you? Aha! What's this about? I can tell you, but you'll be okay. Very dangerous, you, you know. What do you mean? Is it's that risky? Of course. Many friends died to get that password. 
very, very dangerous. They died? Hmm. All in past. Over now. Hmm. Actually, you look strong. You look like a strong man. Maybe you can. Hmm. What is it? N no, it's nothing. Anyway, you want password or no? Please tell me what it is. I you have piqued my interest. Sure, tell me the password. I have to know what that guy is peddling. <laughs> oh, I like you. Stupid, but I like you. Okay, I'll tell you password, but not free. There is condition. What? A condition? Yes. You do a job for me. What is it? It's a simple job. Very easy. I'll explain now. You listen. You go to Taihei Boulevard East, find a restaurant, uh, Yurikute, uh, in front, find a woman named, uh, Monmon. Monmon? Sounds like a Digimon. You talk to Monmon, okay, two things. You ask her plans for today and tomorrow's weather. You got that? Plans for today and tomorrow's weather? That's it? That's it? You ask her, come back, and tell me what she say. See? Very simple. I am surprised Carmen did not pick up the mic there. Got it. I don't get what's going on, but I just had to find out, find Mon Mon, and ask her the plans for today and tomorrow's weather for you. Right. Go screw this up, okay? Alright, where is it? Oh, there, there's so many. I. Oh god, there are a lot more side quests than I thought there were. <laughs> They're everywhere. <laughs> I don't know which one's which. I said to go to a restaurant. Uh, that that's not it. Maybe it's that one. All right. Ah, damn it. Um, excuse me, please. I need help. Hmm. A drunk pervert is harassing my friend. Please, please come help her, Mister Mew. All right, where is she? Th thank you. Over here. Quick. This feels like a trap. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And I, I'm only saying that because her, her name literally was Sketchy Young Woman. <laughs> They're just through here. Sticks away the ominous. Just mew, mew, mew. And this drunk's all alone. Does he have friends? And what do you know? She's gone. Hmm? Where'd she go? Daddy. What the? Ow. She... What's going on here? Nice dodge. Not bad for a shitty Yakuza. I was told there'd be a drunk pervert. You're a too gullible, asshole. <laughs> That's fucking sheer <Take> <laughs> So, that girl's your accomplice. What do you want from me? I just have a small favor to ask. Hmm? Do society a favor and die! Is that my security back there? No, it's just a... a it's, it's just a pedestrian. Oh. Well, that was pathetic. <laughs> Please, don't kill me! You set up an ambush, then beg for mercy. Not the sharpest tool in the shed, are you? Let's see your face. I was kind of hoping it would mew as soon as he kneeled down. Just a kid. So what's your story? Did someone pay you to kill me? No, it's not like that. <laughs> With the stupid cats. <laughs> Then why did you target me? You on the Dojima family payroll? The D Dojima family? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know any Dojima family. I don't care who it was, as long as it was Yakuza. 
I didn't even have to be it didn't even have to be you. What? I hate Yakuza. It's a terrible series and Sega never should have made it. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be better if, it'd be a better world if they all die. People who are fond of the Yakuza are pretty rare. But I'd say it's even rarer to find a nut job willing to jump people in the back alley for no damn reason. How old are you? <laughs> Cats! I'm 16. High school then. Screw high school. I'm in a biker gang. That's a, that's so you're some biker. That's the first time getting into the yakuza. So you're some biker gang grunt. What makes you think I'm a grunt? Well, you're not wearing green, and you don't bonk yourself in the head when anyone follows. Yeah, you're not begging for ice cream. <laughs> and you're also not begging for ice cream. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> right. What's your name? Tanaka. Shinji Tanaka. Shinji Tanaka. And what's your deal? What family are you with? I'm a civilian, not a Yakuza. Yeah, right. I'll ask one more time, Shinji. Get in the damn robot! Nobody put you up to this? That's right. Then why do it? The Yakuza destroyed my family. My old man ran into cash flow trouble flipping real estate. The Yakuza sharks smelled blood in the water, and they took everything. My mom was smart. She ran at the first sight of trouble. Those assholes came and beat my old man every day. Then the old man would be on me because he could. But that stopped once I hit him back. Now he sits around hugging a bottle. Makes me want to put him out of his misery. I can't stand being around him, so I hit the streets. And you thought mugging Yakuza was the answer? I'm gonna steal to live. Yakuza are totally fair game. They're all thieves anyway. And they got reputations to uphold. They can't go crying to the cops if they get their asses kicked. Are you walking a fine line? Yes and no. They're, they're thieves that are actually technically above the law because they have like so much money to throw around that they can buy off people. Hmm. They're all like that. That's basically. Go on. That's basically what this entire entire series is about. Okay, now go moon. No, they're also uh, known for making people disappear very well. Just saying. Are they, they catch, still an issue in Japan? The... Or they kind of died down in the recent years? No, they are. I, I think they... Go on. <laughs> They're not as pr present as they were in the 90s, I, I believe. Or who knows? Maybe I'm completely wrong. You're walking a fine line. If they catch you, they'll kill you without a second thought. <laughs> it's fine. The only ones who know I'm doing this are my bike gang. Guys I can trust. Hope that works out for you. I'm going to go Mew over here now. The, the cat meows ruined this tender moment. <laughs> hey, where do you think you're going? What, you need me to listen to more of your life story? As long as you're not answering to a higher power, I'm done with you. But since you're letting me speak my mind... Quit this Yakuza hunting thing while you're ahead. You're only still alive be through dumb luck. Then, they, when they catch you, and they will, they will, they'll pay you back tenfold. Whatever. I haven't met a Yakuza as tough as you yet. As long as they're alone, they'll go, they go down like chumps. I enjoyed listening to, bake, listening to them beg for mercy. That said, when you kicked my ass, I seriously thought I was dead. Fine. You do what you want. I'm not going to argue about it with a grown man. Take that as a sign, kid. That kid's going to be dead sooner or later. <laughs> But I did what I could. I've got my own problems right now. I get a feeling that we're going to recruit him as security at some point. <laughs> so you want to know your uh, question, Dragon? If they're yes. still active? Yes, there are approximately 28,200 active Yakuza members. Jesus. What the... Oh no, it's that woman again. Who's the unfortunate victim I should connect her to? That telephone club clerk looks like he has a problem on his hands. Ah, sir, can I help you? Yeah. Um, no. Actually, yes, can you get these damn shoes off me? <laughs> I just noticed you seemed like you had a problem. 
Mm -hmm. What's with that stare? Sir. What? <laughs> Your voice is so cool! In fact, it stops me in my tracks! And I'm a straight guy! You're... a lady killer! Uh, oh, little okay. does he know. M maybe with a voice like yours. Lady Killer-san, may I interest you in our telephone club? Are you seriously calling me that? I was just passing by, man. Some other time. Please, a moment, sir. You don't even have to pay. I beg of you. Try out our telephone club. You don't want me to pay? Now I know there's a catch. <laughs> well, yes. I'll be honest with you. You see, we've been getting calls from this strange woman. A strange woman? Yes, it's a woman with a strange voice. The things she says don't make much sense either. She's really weird. She's been calling us nonstop today. But she's so odd, the customers I connect her with end up complaining. I don't wanna I don't wanna patch her through anymore. Sounds like a problem caller, alright. But even if she's odd, a telephone club can't really start refusing calls. That's exactly it, but you're such a lady killer, sir. I think you could be the man to talk her down. What? Me? Destiny calls. Hi. Little dig here, you know, Destiny was the name of the woman that was on the other end of the phone. <laughs> yes, that voice like whiskey, that overflowing sense of empathy and compassion. With a voice like yours, even the weirdest woman can be wrangled. You've got to be kidding me. You don't have to pay. Please. I'm begging you. I guess it's it's at least a chance to get some telephone club practice in for free. What do I have to lose? Uh, no. All right. All right. I'll take the call. I, I need to be Not heading out because uh, I do need to get up early for my second COVID shot. All right. All right. Take care, dude. All right. Night, guys. Night. Good night. <laughs> yes, your lightsaber. I'll show you to a room right away. I'm sure she'll call again soon. The instant she does, I'll patch her through to you. Sure. The clerk said he would patch the color through right away. Is she actually going to call? There's the call. Rick calls about topics that don't make sense. Wonder how this is gonna go. How weird could this lady be? <sighs> Hello? Hi! Are you someone I can finally talk to? I'm so tired of those shit for brain guys handing up the phone. Uh, sure. I'm your man. Her voice is so deep and husky, and she's kind of a gutter mouth. The clerk wants me to deal with this using empathy and compassion. How should I break the ice? Uh, you have a great, you have a great voice. Uh, this is Destiny at work. <laughs> I get a real sense that this is Destiny at work here. Huh? Destiny? How we're exchanging words now, you and I. It comes from coincidence upon coincidences, like gears within gears. You could call it Destiny. We should cherish every moment of it. What? W what are you saying? Don't you get what's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> no need to be so bashful. I want to get to know you better. Why the hell would I give you any details about me? Are you insane? Oh my god, you're gonna kill Then again... <laughs> oh, I know I am. Then again, happy-go-lucky guys like you are what I really wish I could aspire to. Good, she's tough, but she sounds pleased. I guess Nishiki's right. Women really do go for the mushy stuff. But damn, you're such a weird family. But damn, you're such a weird family, and everyone I've talked to at your place is even nuttier. Hmm? My place? Do you know how many times I've called? I keep getting someone different every time. It's been impossible to get this deal to happen. Oh, she, she, I don't think she knows what she's been calling. I think it's like, I want to talk to the manager. Who's in charge here? Oh, dear. So, remember when we said Kiryu hasn't uh, gotten involved with a caring yet? Yeah... We really need to learn to keep our mouths shut. Yeah. <laughs> How big is your family, anyway? My family? What are you talking about? Of course you're not gonna get the same guy every time you call. 
Huh? What are you talking about? You're just one big happy family, aren't you? They must be precious to you. A precious family? Yes, we're a family. Every customer here is a rival competing over incoming calls. I don't know their faces or their names. But we work towards the same goal. We should share a common dream. In that content, not uh, in that context, maybe we are one big family. Yeah, you're right. Everyone here is my precious family. Good, good. Family is precious. Glad there's someone who understands. That'll make our deal go smoothly. <laughs> Smooth like good gin. Deal? Yeah, deal. You know what this is about? It's about the most important thing in your life. The most important thing to me is... Uh, this conversation with you. This time I'm spending conversing with you. Wh what? Would you drop this sentimental bullshit and stop screwing around? <laughs> I'm not screwing around with anyone. I'm enjoying myself just talking with you this way. I think this time is important. Precious, even. Wow. I feel embarrassed just listening to you yap like that. But your voice is kind of soothing. I may even be enjoying this a little. Alright, looking good. I knew women fall, fell for guys who treat them like they're the most important things in life. Wait, what? No, don't try to change the subject on me. There's something that's more important to you, isn't there? Think about it. Hard. Something that's even more important to me. Uh, my convictions? You mean my convictions? Huh? Convictions? Yeah, I've come this far by living by my own convictions. They're important to me, and that won't ever change. I don't care! That's not what I'm talking about! At all! What? It's wrong? You're saying my convictions are wrong? No! Your convictions aren't wrong! In fact, it's kinda cool to be able to say that, actually. If I could've lived like you, I think I would've been able to hold my head high with confidence. Never give up. There's always time. You know, you're a good guy. You're like my grandson. <laughs> Alright, looking good. She's starting to open up. Wait, what? No! Don't try to change the subject on me! There's something that's more important to you. Oh, wait. <clears throat> There's something that's more important to you, isn't there? Think about it hard. Uh, well, the only hard thing to think about would be my manhood. <laughs> you mean, like, my manhood or something? Ha! Well, close enough. I'm talking about your little guy. <laughs> what is with tonight and being focused on Kiryu's crotch, I swear? What are you gonna do to my little guy? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! What shall we do indeed? Oh god. It all depends on your reply. Oh my. Uh, I don't like where this is going. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Finally, you're feeling the heat. You're about to lose the most important thing in your life. Mm -hmm. No, please, I do not want this angle of Kiryu. You're gonna take that away from me? I'm sorry, but I'm not doing anything that hardcore. Oh, but you will. This is serious. If you want your little guy to let loose, bring Cash to the fountain in West Park. What? Cash? Isn't this against the rules? Of course it is. I knew that that's going into this whole thing. Uh, okay. How much money are you expecting, anyway? Fifty. Fifty, and your little guy gets off. Fifty? Uh. Is that really all you want? <laughs> yeah, and come alone. I'm looking forward to this. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, I need some water big time. Holy hell. <gasps> uh, when I listen back to this VOD, it's going to sound interesting at this point. Oh, God, that actually really hurt my throat. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I know for a fact I'm not going to be talking tomorrow morning, but yes. Oh, dear. Oh, Lady Karasan, sir. Thank you so much. You really came through for us. You were on the phone with her for a while. How did it go? I promised to meet her in front of the fountain at West Park. I'm on my way now. Really? You got her to agree to meet up? That's amazing. <clears throat> the other guests all hung up on her because 
The conversations just weren't getting anywhere. I knew you were the one, Lady Killer-san. Your compassion and patience are gold standard. You're the best. I wouldn't say that. Besides, she might be a little different, but I don't think she's a bad person. <laughs> At least this, this should cut down on the weird calls she keeps making. Thank you so much, Lady Killer-san. Stop calling me that! Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I wonder what she's like in person. You come back and tell me, won't you? Sure. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. All right, West. Oh, we actually do have to go into the park for this. Oh, God, how... I forgot Dragon still has the shoes on me. How, how much time do we have left? Just take them off. No, I, I have to. He'll he'll watch the VOD and be like, that cheater. <laughs> nope, not the man in black. All right, don't worry. Got a moped. <laughs> God, that's brutal. Ah, <laughs> uh, you're telling me. Ooh, upside the head. Ooh, foot to the face. And a broken spine. Definitely. Ouch. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I don't have the gloves that make it easier for me to stay held on to enemies. Mm-hmm. And by the hair. And foot to the face. Ooh, just face planted him. And stay down. <laughs> now stay down. <sighs> God, my throat. <laughs> I'm going insane! Oh god, it's him again. Hmm. Wow, that's funky, but maybe a little expensive. You, what are you doing here? Yo, buddy. What does it look like? I'm doing a little window shopping. Would you look at all the toys they have for guys now? <coughs> toys for guys? Oh, right. Those things. So, uh, you tried them? Oh? You're interested? I'm an expert. Of course he would say that. Uh, no, don't worry about it. Forget I asked. <laughs> don't be so bashful. I'll give you my detailed review next time then, okay? Oh, Anyway. God. No. Please. No. <laughs> Please, no. <laughs> Wait, what, what does he keep saying? Something about a, a woman with a ho in the hotel district? I don't even know where the hotel district is. Theater Avenue. Oh, up there. I forgot I had that move. I'm guessing it's probably uh, this substory up here. Something. Oh, God. I don't want any de details. I don't want any dates. I'm good. No, thank you. <laughs> so what you do is you put the lime in the coconut and stir it all up. Kill you, son. <laughs> Remember, lime in the coconut. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I'm, I'm supposed to meet that odd telephone club caller in front of the fountain in the park here. But come to think of it, neither of us told each other what we look like or what to look for. How are we supposed to meet up? Huh? That voice. Could it. Hey, you! Hmm? hmm? What? The Dulette? Velvety tones in that voice, you must be the guy from the phone. Phone? What phone are you talking Dude. about? Dude. Don't play dumb with me. Where's the money? You brought it, right? Money? That's right, money. Come on, hand it over. Or else, your beloved little guy. My beloved little guy? 
Wait, I talked to a woman with a husky voice at the telephone club about my little guy. You must be... A friend of hers! I'll cure you, you dumbass. <laughs> this has gotta be cure you at his dumbest tonight. Huh? Telephone club? I don't know what you're talking about, but that was me on the phone. What? You don't sound like her. She had a husky and sexy voice. Huh? Are you nuts? Why would I phone in a random demand with my real voice? I use a voice module. Oh. Alright, th that means I can kill m I I can rest my voice. Holy hell. Ransom, voice modulator. Then what about the deal to get a little guy off for 50 yen? What are you talking about? Don't you want your son back? Now, fork over the 50 million I told you to bring. Help, I want to go. Oh. Oh. Dumb ass. Holy crap. That telephone caller was a kidnapper. You're not getting a single yen out of me. W what? But why did you come? Because, uh. To protect what's important to me. Aww. Shit. You were never gonna pay the ransom from the start, were you? You asshole! You know too much now. I can't let you walk out of here. And thus, Kiryu's reputation of never hitting women persists. Uh... Come on. Up you go. And down you go. Oh, you know what I should do? Mm. I'll do this. I want to get Maxi. Throw him in the... Throw him in the fountain. Yeah. Come on, come on. Take a swing, take a swing. Got it. And break his arm. Punch him in the face. Oh. Oh. Shit. Damn. Never should have nabbed a kid with a dad so goddamn tough. Listen up. That boy isn't my son. You were calling into a telephone club the whole time. A telephone club? That, that can't be. I doubt the number the kid told me. Well, actually, I could see a neon sign through the window of the, the room I was locked up in. I didn't want Mommy or Daddy to worry, so I just told you the telephone numbers that were on the sign. Th then you're... Yeah, just a telephone club customer. No wonder my ransom demands were getting nowhere. <laughs> Everybody's just a dumbass tonight, I swear. Even... My business went bust. I lost my house and my wife left with the kids. And now I got conned by the kid I abducted, savaged by a telephone club customer, and no money to show for it. Where did my life go so wrong? It's not too late to turn things around. Uh, I'm pretty sure kidnapping a kid uh, is the point of no return. Oh, thank God. I can now take these damn shoes off. <laughs> oh, thank you. Huh? After you've had some time to think about your crimes and... You're set free. I'll take you to the telephone club. <laughs> huh, that's great. Something to look forward to. If they're still around when I'm out. Thanks, buddy. You know, I'm glad I got to talk to you on the phone. It was an enjoyable conversation. Here, hold on to this, would you? It won't help me where I'm going. A super spicy knife. Okay. Thanks. I guess I had fun, too. Well, sounds like the cops finally got word of the ruckus. I'll go quietly. Don't worry. <laughs> Talk to you later, telephone buddy. Yakuza, everybody. Thank you for rescuing me, mister. Sure. Are you alright? Yep. That kidnapper man was really nice. Was he? Hey, hey, mister. What's a telephone club? Oh, no. Don't I do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, well, it's like a playground for grown-ups where you can meet new people. Oh, that sounds fun. I want to go to a telephone club. No! Like I said, it's for grown-ups. I swear, if, if this kid actually uh, wants to work at the real estate company, I'm going to lose it. Oh, wait. Oh, sweet salvation. <laughs> Give me those gloves back. Oh, thank God. Uh, silence to my ears. I love it. 
<laughs> Calm down, TBG. <laughs> no. No. You have not had to endure the mewing all night. Uh, no, because I got turned down pretty low, so I didn't have to hear it. <laughs> exactly, so you don't know my pain. Uh-oh. Great, now what? Hey, you. Can I just walk out of a park and just walk through the streets of Kamurocho without an interruption every ten minutes? Nope. You talking to me? We see anybody else? Come with us. We need to have a little chat. Who are you guys? Doesn't matter who we are. But you, on the other hand, you know a kid named Shinji Tanaka? Uh, no. Hmm? He told us all about you. You don't need me to spell it out, spell out the rest of you. I have no idea what you're talking about. Huh? Don't play dumb with me! You use that kid to go after our boys! Daddy. What? The kid ratted you out, so quit playing dumb and come along. This is what happens when you screw with the Jinsei family. You guys caught Shinji? What did you do with him? <laughs> huh, your concern for that little shit is real touching, and it's a good as a signed confession. You're the guy he's working for. But don't worry about a thing. You'll see him real soon, so quit dragging your ass and come with us. <laughs> no wonder the Jinsei family is a, sh is a shit stain of the third world uh, stream family. You guys don't know anything about etiquette. Huh? huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> you want to take me somewhere? You better bow first. If you can't do that, then piss off. Why, fucking punk, forget it. We'll beat the shit out of you here and now. I mean, you can try. It's not going to work. You know why? Because I got a giant fan! <laughs> wow, that really blew away the competition. Oh dear. Alright, what else can we use? What is the Master Ball? Oh, it's a, it's a bowling ball. Ugh. Right in the kneecap. I've got a sign. I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> Whack him upside the head. Who the hell is this guy? This is crazy. Where's Shinji? That punk better still be alive. <laughs> Show me where he is, but you ought to know. I'm not the guy pulling his strings. He lied to you. What? He dragged me into this. He's gonna pay for it. Oh, I see. So that's how this went down. We're on the same page, though, man. Uh? Then take me to him now. Quit stalling. I yes, sir. That's less of a beard and more of a goatee. <laughs> Didn't expect to find a kid like this mulling our boys. So, we're the guy filling this punk's head with I uh, with ideas. Still can't find him? Yeah, not sure what the holdup is. D you! You did come for me! Came to kick your ass, boy! Well, well, well. So this is our mastermind, eh? Wait, where's the boys who brought you? They're taking a nap outside. You sure pulled out all the stops to deal with one stupid kid. What a circus. W wait a minute, I... I recognize that bastard. Huh? huh? It's Kiryu! The Dojima family put a bounty on him! It's the guy the Dojima family's after, Kazuma Kiryu! What? You're shitting me! K Kazuma Kiryu? Why would a walking dead man invite this kind of shit? I can bother hunting down weaklings like you. Shinji here shoved a loaded a load of BS down your throats. <laughs> ha! So that's the story. Well, screw it. I don't give a shit anymore. It's our lucky day. 
All we gotta do is take this clown to the Dojima family, and we're in good graces for the most powerful family in Kamurocho. Yeah, about that. I'm I'm kind of off the hook with the Dojima family, so... <laughs> Alright. Cave is facing. Here's our ticket to the big leagues. It looks like someone already caved that guy's face in. Holy hell. He's got like a freaking crazy look to him. <laughs> also, this is just the place that we uh, went with the... The, the tax evasion lady. I just noticed that, too. Yeah. Hold on. No. Hold on, it's time for you to take it. Okay, fine, this will work. At least I'll knock them on their asses. Alright, you all look tired. Um, why don't you take a seat? We'll table this for later! Save the table talk for later. Nope, we already beat them all. <laughs> <laughs> And thankfully, everything is back to normal. What is with Kiryu this? works fast rebuilding furniture. The con Damn, you are freakishly tough. What? The concept designs of the suits are just beyond. <laughs> That's actually kind of a bit. That was a big thing back in the 90s in Japan. Yuck. The flashier, the better. Yuck. Damn, you are freakishly tough. So, you're Cosmic Kiryu. I heard about you. The whole dojo my family is out hunting for you. That's brutal, man. You're taking on the whole dojo my family by yourself? I wish I was half at... I had half the kind of strength. It worked you over pretty good. Did that pound some sense into your thick... into that thick skull of yours? As if. How did they find out you were the ones going after them? Someone in the gang ratted me out. They got scared the Yakuza would come after them if my cover got blown. So they turned me over in exchange for their safety. Heh. <laughs> when I think about it, I can see why they did it. I was an idiot for trusting them. One more question. Why did you tell those goons that I was the one ordering you to go on this Yakuza beating spree? Yeah. Because if I didn't give them something, these guys were going to take me out and bur bury me up in the mountains. I figured there was no way they could take you on. So, I gave them a description. Told them you were my boss. I had to. I thought, maybe you'd come and save me. You just seemed like the kind of guy. No. Yeah, what the hell? What were you think you were doing? And what have you been doing your whole life? Huh? The gun's to your head. And the first guy who comes to mind is a complete stranger you've only met once? No family, friends, or relatives you could trust to throw out there? Eh. Instead, you've been acting like some vigilante jackass trying to take out the Yakuza until they finally won. What the hell kind of life is that? Nobody ever taught me to trust. I never had anyone around to show me what to do, so I figured it out as I went. No one taught me anything about how to live. Grow up. You can't blame this on your father or the people who failed you. You have to fight your own damn battles. I'm no exception. I'm trying to do my damn hardest to live. But you're so damn strong. I was just lucky I had a mentor. I did have someone who gave me something I could aspire to be. He's a Yakuza, though, so I guess that means you automatically hate him. He's your role model? He's Shintaro Kazuma, the captain of the Dojima family. If I could be half the man he is, I'd be all alright, but I'm not even close to that. Shinji, the Yakuza have their eyes on you now. You can't stick around. Get out of Kamurocho and find yourself someone you can trust. So I'm going to show you the ropes. Get out of Kamurocho? I can't do that, Kiryu-san. I'm not running away. What? Besides, you got way more Yakuza on your tail than I do, don't you? I'm staying put. Have it your way. If that's how you choose to live, like I said before, I won't argue with you. Yeah, that's my decision. Promise me this, though. Cut ties with your sorry little gang. And if you're going to live in this town... I want you to figure out how to outlive me, Shinji. Hey, Kiryu-san. One last thing. What made you come save me? You're already at the top of the Dojima family's hit list. Why take the risk? Who knows? I don't know why, why I do half the things I do. But when I was a kid, I was alone, I was alone too. If I hadn't met Kazuma-san, I'd probably be a lot like you are now. 
See you around, Shinji. Kiri-san, I think I found someone I can aspire to be. In fact, I hope someday I can be even better than you. No matter where you go, I'm going to be just one step behind you. Just watch. Kiri-san, sir. Hmm. That was surprisingly wholesome. Sotha tells me he's going to be in future games. What, like, as a protagonist or, like, a a side character? Like a side character kind of thing. Like, like main side character or cameo side character? Like a cameo. Just cameo from time to time. All right. <clears throat> All right, I think we've been messing around in Camarocho enough. I, let's head back to the place to collect our money, because I think it's well past collection day. <laughs> ah, crap. Not the men in black again. Here come the men in black. Uh, that's basically the theme of Camarocho. How do you have less money? <laughs> like, last time I saw him walking around, he had, like, 7 million, like, 500,000. And now he's just walking around with 6 million. Maybe he's getting his ass kicked, and he keeps losing mm. it. <laughs> Speaking of, I, I want to have him kick my ass so he can start building up some money, but at the same time, I kind of don't want to, because I want to keep my money to buy up the properties. Yeah, and you also need to level up. Yeah, definitely that. And like I said, I want to focus on getting my properties up before I decide to start leveling up my fighting. Mm-hmm. Alright, let's see what we got. Economy is good. Alright, so let's just start another collection there. Uh, yeah, he is done for this collection period, so... Uh, Suno, you can take over. And I'll keep uh, security there. They're like, I need a break, man. <laughs> Can I go on a couple day vacation? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that should take care of Pachinko. Yep. Probably could have used a less expensive one, but I just wanted to be sure. <laughs> Alright, Masura, you got this. And that's everything that we can invest in for the tech area. Nugget's doing good. He's got two collections, and then I need to swap out security, though. Mm. Sure, we'll, we'll put him there. Come on. Ah, just barely. I probably could invest into some fighting techniques for now because uh, actually I probably could invest in the the gambling area to get more money from there. There you go. Now that I think about it. Cuz everything to invest in here hasn't either unlocked or uh it's just I'm doing something wrong. Uh probably not progressing the story. Maybe. Nugget's got that taken care of, so let's send him out. <laughs> and Mama, you work on the Soba place. And we'll send that collection out. Uh, wait, we need to swap out security. Mm-hmm. Eh, sure. We'll put you there. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, what's the matter? You look upset. Mr. President, I'm disappointed in you. Uh-oh. What did I do this time? Huh? Never thought you were the kind of person who would go to all those kinds of places, Mr. President. Oh, dear. Hey, hold your horses. What the heck are you talking about? 
Well, just look at this. It's a coupon for an adult shop. <laughs> <laughs> Dear valued customer, to show our appreciation for your repeated patronage, we would like to offer our services for absolutely free! Please drop by our shop with this postcard to redeem its exclusive offer. Absolutely free, huh? Wow. Aww. What do you mean, wow? <laughs> you go to these kind of places so often they're giving you loyalty rewards? Uh, no. That's not me. Well, at least I've never been to that shop. Aww. Then why'd you get this postcard? And wait, are you saying you've been to other places? Oh my. I don't know what to think. Hey, don't judge. Besides, are you sure it's really addressed to me? You sure it's not for Yamanoi san? Whoa, don't drag me into this. Yeah. No, it's gotta be for Yamanoi san. The slender, the sender of the addressee are. Huh? What's wrong? It's addressed to. me. See, I knew it! Hmm? But the sender is... the Pleasure King. What? Does that mean the Pleasure King is challenging you? Uh. Most likely, yeah. We've taken over a bunch of the properties in the Pleasure King territory already. It makes sense. The Pleasure King has gains of hooligans under his control, so you should be careful when going to face him. Right. Thanks for the heads up. This adult shop is on Sinrio Avenue. I'll go check it out. Why not? It's absolutely free, right? Oh, come on, you know that's not why I'm going. Pleasure King wants to see me. I should head over to Sanrio Avenue. It's it's like a, a brick to the face that Marina has a thing for Kiryu. Oh, yeah. She likes him. He's just he's just too dense to realize it. I love, though, how they are like, it's like, it's him. It's the old man. He's like, bruh. <laughs> don't, don't drag me into your lover's, lover's quarrel. All right, where's Senrio? Senrio Avenue North. Oh no. Mm. Oh no. There's only one place there. Oh no. And you know what that place? No. How do you challenge someone in that? Oh no. No, I don't want to think about it. Oh no. I don't want to think. I don't want to think about it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like that stupid video. Oh no. <laughs> oh no no no. <laughs> Oh, he's got a taser. <laughs> Swing your partner round and round. Smack his friends and throw him to the ground. <laughs> oh, a taser for me? Oh, you shouldn't have. I'll take that. Zap. I see you, Zap. <laughs> I wonder if that actually happens. If you stick a taser in the back of someone's neck, they just plank like that. Yes, they do. Ooh, platinum plate. <laughs> Wait, how do you know that happens, Moon? Is there something you're not telling me? Hmm? I had a friend that went to the police academy and they have to be tasered. Ah, okay, that makes sense. And when they get shocked, there's like, you know, a thousand volts of freaking electricity going through your body. You're gonna... You're gonna tense up. <laughs> God, I don't I don't think I'd have it cut out for me to be an officer if that means I have to go through a taser process. Oh, it's not just that. They pepper spray you, too. I know, exactly. Like I said, I probably won't have it in me to do something like that. I'd be like, no. I don't know if you know this, I don't like pain. <laughs> Even though I hurt myself with some of the game choices that I that I pick for these streams. And work. And on a daily basis. <laughs> uh, okay, thank god it's not here. <sighs> oh, thank god. <laughs> no, don't watch a video. <laughs> I'm not, don't worry. <laughs> but that's like the only... Samaria Avenue. It said San Rio, right? San Rio. Oh, oh no! It's the Telephone Club. Oh boy. So it's not as bad, but it's still kind of bad. It's still bad. It's the Telephone Club. Ah shit! 
thought I could avoid these guys. Damn it, the knee high barrier didn't protect me from these hooligans. Oh no, no, not. Oh, oh! <laughs> Carry you, please. I can't take much more of this. Hmm? That guy does not have a spine anymore. Oh, ow. <laughs> Even he's just like, I can't move. I legit if I don't move, maybe he won't hurt me anymore. <laughs> like, taking a metal baseball bat to the face is nothing when I just saw someone get a spine split in two. Up against the wall. And that should be it. Nope. So I think oh, you. these are like the greasers. Because they've got like the grease jackets on and stuff. Yeah, I think I think that might be it. I don't know. Or they're just hooligans. Alright, you know what? Since we aren't going to be buying up any more property... I might as well level up some of my fighting styles. <laughs> He's not human. <laughs> uh, what's this? Draw upon your energy deep within you with sand attacks that normally would knock you down. Not bad. But th I'd have to be under my third heat bar. Max health. Uh, body counter. A few blows unleashed from the guard position. That's not bad. Increase the amount of the heat gauge rises when you attack it. Ooh, I want that one. <laughs> Oh, wow. Uh, why is... That is super weird that only half of Rush has been unlocked. There's still two other sections that are still locked up, even though we beat the Tech King. Hmm. Weird. Uh, let's see. What do we got? Oh, I got... I can spend a couple uh, million. Increase the power of the regular attacks and heat. Uh, your heat gauge will slowly rise over time when you're wounded. However, you only fill up to the second bar. Boost max health. Improves the evasion of quick step. More distance with quick step. An evasive move that adds the actions after a rush combo. Adds the effect after... Oh, step out. Oh, okay, so QE will automatically, like, back step away from enemies that are about to attack after finishing a combo. Ooh, that's a good one. Put your guard against an enemy attacks. The place distance between you and the enemy works with a number of heat bars when attacked from the enemy... Uh, after an enemy breaks your guard. But you don't have a guard in Rush. So how's that? Alright, whatever. <laughs> I do want to work uh, up my Rush combo, though. Essence of short Sword Shattering. Use the Fist of Iron to engage an enemy carrying a sword and shatter their weapon. Ooh, that looks cool. But I need, like, a, a knuckle weapon. Mm-hmm. Mighty Charge Kick. Uh, let's see. Essence of Iron Fist. Knock an enemy into the air, then ring blows down. Uh, basically do an aura, aura, aura against him, I see. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to work towards this. So we'll uh, up our heat gauge at certain times during while we guard. There you go. I'm actually really liking Rush, so... Yep, there he is. Mm hmm? Hmm? Is that? It was so awful. Oh, honey, I know how you feel. I realize it was hard on you, but you know you really can't deny your customer like that. If you quit now, all your hard work will be for nothing. But, but... It'll be okay. Nothing bad will happen. Leave it to me, honey. You trust me, don't you? Yes, of course. I've never been able to trust anyone else in the business, but I trust you like an older sister. <laughs> then you do your big, what your big, big sis says, huh? Just hang in there for a little bit more for me. Okay, thanks for looking out for me. I'll work even harder. You know, aside from, like, the, the first billionaire... Oh, never mind. I was about to say, the other billionaires that we come across have been somewhat decent people. Like, the, the, the electronics one was just someone who just wanted to get into the business because mm -hmm. he felt like it was something he could pull off. I was being like, oh, this is actually someone who cares about them. Nope. Not at all. What a basic biatch. Complain about a customer's little fetish like that. Uh, Jaguar Chan? Yes. 
I think it's about time we offer that little tuna to the usual fish market. To them? Don't you think that might be a bit soon for that? Maybe we should see how things go. That hussy's getting huffy over a little thing like that. I can't expect much more to offer her in the future. Besides, she worked enough to pay back her debt, and then some. She might realize it soon, so now's the time to do it. Wow. This person's absolute scum. Horrible. Understood. This thing is dressing up as a woman. <clears throat> oh, my God. This is getting... Hopefully this doesn't get taken out of context for me. <clears throat> Oh, women are so stupid, and the men who spend big money on them are equally stupid. I suppose in the end, they're all just idiots eating each other out. <laughs> hmm? That's... <coughs> oh my. If it isn't Kiryu-chan, you naughty boy, you should have let me know you were here. You look sexy as always. Okay. <laughs> so did you come for fun, or free coupon to get your attention, did it? You're a big boy with a healthy appetite, after all, Kiryu-chan. No, that's not it. You're the one who called me out here. Oh, now that you mention it, you're right. I absolutely forgot about that. Silly me. Honey, won't you play a little game with me? A game? You took on the leisure cane in the karaoke battle, right? I want some one-on-one -on -one time with you, too. Uh -oh. I think I'm dropping frames. No, I dropped a few, but that's fine. What kind of battle would this be? Hmm, let's see. We're all adults here, so we can make it something fun. Oh, no. Contemplating Kiryu's making a return. Mm. Oh, I know. Let's make it a telephone club battle. Ready? A telephone club battle? Yeah. Right. If you manage to score a date with a girl within three minutes, you win. How's that? Hot stuff. Of course, if you win, you get a slice of my property pie. If you lose, you give me a share of your holdings instead. How can I trust you? You run these places. Isn't there going to be some kind of catch? I'm not going to do anything shady. That's the T for truth. The game's no fun if you cheat. Don't you trust me? Right. We'll use the Telltale Boys Club. I'm not involved in the management there, so the battle will be fair and square. Will that be okay with you? Sure, that's fine. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay then. Let's do this! <laughs> okay, let's get it on, honey. I win if I score a date with a girl in three minutes, right? <laughs> That's right. No shade, but you don't seem like the type to go on into telephone clubs. Do you really think you can pull this off? <laughs> don't judge a book by its cover. I already got a date from here. Love is on the line at the telephone club. If you get a date with a girl within three minutes, you win your share of uh, the pleasure king area and increases by 10%. If you lose, it goes down by 10. Smooth operators get a share of the area. Oh, God, I, I remember how awkward this is because you actually have to, like, rotate the stick like you're dialing a rotary phone. Yes, I remember. <laughs> All right, let's see. Get, that, get the timing on that. Which way do you, I have to rotate it? Target the detail, dialogue line. Okay, wrote it, rotated that, and then release. Shoot the right dialogue line, build the mood, but if you hit the wrong one, your character might say something that could upset the girl. Then it rotates, press A when it's in front, and that's basically it. <laughs> it's time! There we go. Easy to talk to. God, this is so awkward. <laughs> Got it. What's your favorite sport? Meatball, mothball, basement, baseball. Mm? There's different uh, words that try to throw you off, like how they also reverse and flip. Mm. You, you gotta, you gotta basically pick it out. What to say? What to say? What to say, buddy? Of course. Huh? 
And the worst part is, as you progress and you get the right choice, uh, the detail of the girl actually gets more in focus to try and distract you. Oh, I know. I know. I remember. <laughs> I watched one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, say something nice. You're my papa, you're not popular, you're popular. Oh, that should have hit! Oh man, this thing's flying all over the place. Got it. Any ideas for a date? Karate, karaoke, karaoke, kangaroo. Let's go on a date with kangaroos. No, not car. I want a karaoke, not car, okay? I can tell her what she seems like. You seem nice. You have a niece. You like mice. You like ice. Ah, damn. This thing's slippery. Come on. There. Got it. Yes, I saw that. Your body type. Mean and muscular, lean and muscular. Got it. I don't know what that big one was. <laughs> Might have been like meat and muscular. You sound like a yak! Ouch! And that's when Kiryu immediately hangs up the phone. Why frickin' hell? Why the close-ups? Don't worry, I got contemplating Kiryu. How about a pickup line? Kind of whiny. It's destiny. What should I call you? Sweetheart, steward, ironheart, uh, supreme leader. Kind of wanted to pick supreme leader. <laughs> What should I ask her about? The blue feathers, young baby ferrets, your best feature. Got it! I honestly thought I was gonna get ferrets there for a second. Can we meet? I would like to get you no to know you better. Where's Kiryu? There we go. That's actually the perfect placement for his text box. Hooray, we found love. Also heaven. God, this game is dumb, but I love it. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> How's that? I scored a date. <laughs> oh, honey. I should have known you'd get around. You were fabulous. Congratulations. Fabulous? Wait. How do you know about how the conversation went? No way. Yes way, the color on the other end was me! <sighs> no, how can how can that be? The voice was completely different. Oh, don't underest underestimate the pleasure, Kane. It's easy peasy for me to change my voice like that. Wow, but your seduction technique was so fierce. You really turned me on. Oh, God. I'm never going to make that mistake again. Oh, come on. Don't be so uppity. We had our little fun, and I gave you a share of my area, as promised. So, does this mean the date is off? I won, but somehow I feel like I lost. 
That's <laughs> basically the, I've won, but at what cost? Oh dear, you managed to close the gap with me again. I better get serious pretty soon. Oh, Jaguar-chan. Yes. Hmm? What? Be a deer and take care of him, would you? Oh boy. Hey! You haven't taken advantage of our absolute free service offer yet, right? This is my present for you, honey. And don't forget, it's not like I'm letting you off so easy next time. <laughs> that is, of course, if you manage to survive after dealing with the boys. Well then, I hope you enjoy our service. Boy. Hey, wait! Whoa, excuse me, sir. You'll need to deal with us. No substitutions allowed during the promotion. <laughs> okay, let's get started. Enjoy our absolutely free service. <laughs> Ooh, and right next to a bike. How... How coincidental. How convenient. <laughs> how convenient. That's the word I meant to say. Here, have this bike. It's on the house! I think this poor guy in the purple suit's just like, get me out of here. <laughs> alright, alright. I want You want out of here? Alright, fine. Here, take a nap. Mm, and there's a spine breaker. <laughs> Jaguar's down. <laughs> yep, I know. Ah, damn it. Come on, come on. Break your hand. That was honestly easier than the Electronics King. Well, you probably have to fight the Pleasure King eventually. <laughs> Well, yeah, I have to fight them all. <laughs> Talk about a rough customer. Sorry about that. Don't worry. I'll never come back to a place like this. Pleasure King. He's more tough than, and cold-blooded than I thought. I'll have to face him in battle soon, and I'm not gonna be, and it's not gonna be easy. God, there's actually still a side story at the the phone club. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not doing it right now. We're already at time, so I'm gonna just head back to the to the office and uh, get our earnings. <laughs> no, I am not paying ten thousand yen. <laughs> I don't care how busy you are; I'll just walk the way. I'm just gonna push people all the way. Out of the way, I got money to make. Hundred thousand. If it's not a million, I don't care. I just love the lights. It's like I feel like I'm in like a Las Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> so much lights. <laughs> All right, let's make some money. You are no good to me anymore. Hmm. How about the electronics king in charge of here? Alright, you are good for a few more collections, but I will swap out security. No good, I think is good. Yeah, he's good for this one, and then I need to swap him out. I forgot I actually need to invest first. Mm -hmm. Alright, that's an S rank. Hopefully this pushes it over the... Ah, just barely. Alright, that's a rank. Just pour all our money back into this stuff. <laughs> oh, nice. Alright. And 
and invest into there. Just get mama real quick. Alright, start collection. And let's get a new rush move. Because now we can upgrade our combo attack. Oh, no, that's 40 mil or 400 million. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, you don't have 400 mil. <laughs> I will get Essence of Iron Fist, though. There you go. Knocking him into the air, the ring blows down upon him. Uh, guard, then why when Knuckles are equipped? I need to find Knuckles. Maybe Bob has some. Mm, maybe. Either that or maybe the the pawn shop. Heat wave, heat retention. Essence of Beast, dual stab. Stab an enemy with a pull snapped in two. Unleash the huge devastating potential only used with pulls found lying around. Ugh. Oof. So yeah, it seems dark blue are new fighting uh, techniques or new heat moves that you can unlock. Hmm. And then light blue is just basically new combos you can get. Okay. What are the red? And red, I believe, are things that associate with uh, getting heat. Ah. And yellow is health health wise. Hmm. That makes sense. All right. Not for now, the only heat move we can get is sword shattering, but again, we need we need knuckles for that. And brawler, let's see. I think heat retention, heat wave, heat reduction. I think what, yeah, brawler for all the red ones is the uh, stuff related to drinking. <laughs> all right. Well, that, ladies and gentlemen, is where we're going to end it off tonight because we have already passed time and we have been going for four and a half hours. Oh, God. And my throat is actually starting to give out on me. I don't know if it's been showing over time. Mm, not really, but... <laughs> now, give give it tomorrow morning. You'll, I'll be like, hey, everybody, how's it going? <laughs> okay. Let's see if there's anyone still streaming right now. Uh, let's see. Uh, already rated them recently. How about you? Chances are probably no, but who knows? Maybe. Possibly. Probably. Oh, yes, they are streaming. Nice. Nice. Alright. I'm actually happy that the first person I paid to actually was still streaming. Nice. Right. And I already got an idea for... What, what we're going to raid with tonight. Oh, dear. <laughs> Damn it. What? I accidentally, I, I highlighted the, the raid message and typed it in. It was just like, Pizza Hut in your local area. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> All right. We are going to raid Green Power Star, who is currently playing through Super Mario Bros. 2. That is the... Actually, a, a if I remember right, it's a remake of a Japanese game that actually is a lot easier than the Japanese version. Hmm. Uh, we're gonna raid them with hashtag Pizza Visa. Pizza Visa. <laughs> Honestly, I w it was either between that or Kiryu's Wild Ride, but I think Pizza Visa is better. I think Pizza Visa is safe. <laughs> but yeah. The ride never ends. Uh. Uh. All right. Uh, if you haven't seen it already, a new slide video went up last night, or I guess tonight, because it's still technically nighttime. So be sure to check it out. Other than that, tomorrow night will be more 3D World and hopefully the end of 3D World. 
And unfortunately, that is where streams are going to have to take a small hiatus just because I need to focus on some other things to take care of next week. So after we're done with 3D World, there won't be any more streams until, let's see, maybe on uh, Monday, April 5th. And maybe I'll make that like a, a Yakuza collection night, who knows, or maybe something to re relax with. Maybe some Loop Hero, because I do find that game oddly uh, relaxing, even though it's a very dark and weird game. <laughs> Alright, uh, go get pre Green Power Star, some love. Uh, Mario Land 2, pretty good game, highly recommend it. I actually need to finish it myself, because I actually do have it for the 3DS, and I need to get back into playing it. See you all tomorrow for some 3D World. Good night, everybody.